What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Last time we streamed, we had a accident where the game crashed, which really sucked. But in the meantime, Yordi has gone back and cleaned everything back up. Like, uh, I did not stop streaming at that point. I just stopped recording. I didn't really feel like... Uh... Oof. I didn't really feel like going back and doing everything again. Uh, and recording it, which was kind of a waste of time. If I did. Uh, so we're just gonna continue where we left off. And, um... You know... Do a thing. Wouldn't it be hilarious if the game crashed again on the mini game that I'm trying to do? That's a joke. That would not be funny. Gun at Hein. Took a hit at some work, Jesus. Sucks. I don't like this whatsoever. to beat all five stages. The hell, I can barely see what the fuck is going on. Okay, didn't take that much damage. So far, so good. This mini game is weird as fuck. I don't like it whatsoever. Are there any other buttons I can use? Automatically move. Seem to be doing a okay so far. Say that, but I'm getting my absolute ass kicked right now. There it is. That is a 
is gonna require a lot of... ...getting used to. Tell where I'm aiming. Or where my enemy is, for that matter. Is the stage three big balls? I'm dead. I'm okay. There's no way I actually won that. Okay, 4.4. This is fucking terrifying. Four point Okay. Stage one.
with H2. Last one. I actually did it. First try this bullshit. Hey, Lizzie, sorry. I'm here, I'm here. What is this trippy shit? Am I on drugs? Is this what a drugs feels like? <sighs> this was a stupid ass Mizzy, Mizzy game? Mizzy game? Mini game, Lizzy, that I tried first try, and yes, it felt like I was on drugs as well. Missy. <laughs> uh, Lizzy, how are you doing? That's another mini game done. If I know your Gudenhain, I'm good. I'm at work. Nice. How was uh, Vegas? We haven't actually talked about Vegas much yet, Lizzie. And I am uh, doing okay ish. Could be worse, could be better. You know how it goes. Who the fuck are you? Gordon Nambo, yeah. Oh, my bag is full. It took a bit of time, but I'm finally back uh, to. Uh, at least I think I'm back in stableness. Miss my vacation. I need another one. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Lizzie, you just you just came back from vacation. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let me think. What else can we do at this very moment? This is... Being in not my bed. Oh, this is another food store. And having someone else make my bed. Luxury, Lizzie, luxury. A filet mignon. What the hell is that? Uh, let me have a look. Map. This is Sega. This is Golf. This is Pachinko. What is this? Ricci Towers Mayong. Prime? I don't know what that is. Karaoke. Oh, that is the Flirt Club. Uh, 
Vatami. Okay, I think we're gonna continue the story. After I went for a practice session because I've not played in almost a week. Oh, with mash and asparagus. You fancy steak. Did you... You killed the fancy steak with asparagus? Ugh. Ugh. How could you, Lizzie? How could you? They murdered the steak with asparagus? Zero out of five. Would not come back again. <laughs> dinner, dinner, chicken dinner. Ah, I've been busy drawing today. Finally getting back into the flow of my study. Haruka, walk faster. Okay, let's talk to teacher. Half a burrito I need to go heat up. Only half a burrito? Onigashimasu! So much more. Hard lesson for max experience. Okay, we can do this. It's been a while. Oh shit! I'm fucked up. I thought we were at the end already.
I can't believe I fucked up at the end because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> About a billion times already, so you ought to know by now. The music for round one is a cutesy pop song called So Much More. T says specialty is hard dance number, so the song takes him a little out of their element. So first round, I think you got a chance, but you better bust your butt practicing if you want to win. That was all according to plan, guys. <laughs> I got distracted. I needed to pay attention to the chat. La da 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 na na na. Okay, let's go do um, story progress because we haven't done that yet. In a bit. Pretty sure I've done everything that I can for now until a little bit later. For training and such. I need to actually open that up. Training. Yoko and Tatsuya. Other than that, I don't think there's much that I can do. Well, yeah, we can do the... Where is it? Open up the sub-stories. Need to do that soon as well. And side stories. Road to fame. Okay, I think I have everything open then. Schedule! Princess League round one. You're already getting way too into it. Shh. Don't tell anyone. おそや、おせっかくやし、衣装に着替える前にプロデューサーのマンダさんに挨拶しとこうか。マンダさん。マンダさん。あ、おっとった。ほら、あそこにおるのがマンダさん。行こう。Super fab with the ugly stash and the Whatever outfit. まずいな。T また。失礼します。どうも、マンダさん。大の地屋の堀江です。本番前にご挨拶をと思いまして。熱。え。おお、ビーチーズ。マンダさん。大事な決勝戦前やってのに随分なご挨拶やな。何やってんの？ ちゃんと前見て歩かないと。ああ、ビーチーズ。ビーチーズ。ダイナチェアさん。ええ、ごめんなさい。あ、その、ほんまに何と言っていいか。一度のミスで全てを失うこともある。それにな、君はもっとど
I will. This time I will pay attention, we'll get perfect score. この先にこいつの控室を用意してもらってるんや。さきうちのはるかに足かけたやろ。どういうつもりなんや。ちょっと話してよ。中井さん。あ、look <laughs> If Kiryu was here, he'd be like, Oh!元々言えば、君がはるかに足引っ掛けて妙な言いがかりはやめていただけませんかねそっちがそういう気ないやったらこっちもそれなりの対応取らなあきまへんオタクみたいなちっちゃい事務所ステップ on her toes, step on his toes! Do it with the heel! Break his fucking foot! I'm playing Yakuza too much, we need more aggression, guys. だからタレントに逃げられちゃうんじゃないの。堀江さん、こんなことしてる場合じゃないです。早く衣装着替えなきゃ。ちょっと待ちなさいよ。このまま行くけ。この腕どうしてくれんの？何？沖縄は行った
Setting aside their obvious lack of manners, they certainly look professional. I don't know anything about your level of talents, but right now you're clearly at a disadvantage. That may be true, but what else can I do but my best? Listen up, little bumpkin. I'm sorry if this stinks a bit, but simply doing your best won't earn you any recognition in this industry. You have to learn to magnify your natural appeal several times over if you want to make it. And right now, you don't know how. The biggest difference between you and your opponents. You just need a little push in the right direction, and I'm the perfect person to give it to you. No time for questions. Now show me your outfit. Come on, let's see it. Okay. No, it's not a compliment. How dare you disregard my ginger prowess? Hmm, not bad, not bad. Hmm. See what happens when you're in the hands of a professional. Oh, by the way, Bumpkin, I have a little present for you. What is it? A quick change costume. It's old, special design of mine. And just can't bear to see it go to waste. So I want you to have it. Quick change is all about timing, my dear. When you feel the timing is right, change into this and watch everyone be blown away. Oh, my goodness, thank you very much. Uh, it's a new thing. How dare you disregard my ginger prowess. <laughs> now that Haruka has received the quick change outfit from Yoko, she can use Climax Heat on the Princess League. When the icon will... Uh, like the one... Uh, appear, blah blah blah, press, indicate button, Harker will change costume, idle heat will then remain until the end of the song, making button press more efficient. In order to climax heat on the Princess League, your climax heat gauge must be filled beforehand. Go see Yoko before the final round to fill your gauge. Now the rest is up to you, little bumpkin. Thank you again, Yoko-san. But why are you being so nice to me? Well, you remind me of someone, a certain idol I used to work on. But in the end, I wasn't able to make her shine like she deserved. I see, this is uh, my second chance. Part of my own little agenda, you might say. If that bothers you, feel free to say so. Bother me? Of course not. I'm very grateful to you. Good. Well done. I think I'll get going. You can find me under Yao Bridge in Sotombori if you ever want to learn more beauty secrets. Good luck now. Lizzie dares all the time. Lizzie's a scary person. We don't mess with Lizzie. There are many advanced Yoko's training. Fill the climax heat gauge. It boosts the number of times idle heat can be used. Greatly improves appeal. Train with Yoko before a Princess League round to prepare for yourself for victory. No, Jumbi Dicta. Jumbi Dicta. Yeah, I'm there. Do this. ああ、バッチリや思うで。バッチリもんで。これまでメイクとかあまりしたことなかったから。大丈夫。これやったらティーセットのファンかて、はるかちゃんにメロメロや。あと、そろそろお時間やな。大丈夫。君やったらいつもの
ライブパフォーマンスの最中観客の皆様には優れたパフォーマンスをしていると思うアイドルのステージ近くへと移動していただきます最終的にパフォーマンス終了時点で多くの観客を集めたアイドルが勝者となります決勝戦の対戦は計3ラウンド第1ラウンドはポップ対決アイドルとしての可愛さと歌唱力を総合的に争います第2ラウンドはダンスナンバー対決アップテンポの曲に合わせたダンスはもちろんいかに観客を盛り上げるようなライブパフォーマンスができるかが勝負のポイントとなります第1ラウンド第2ラウンドの対戦で相手の組よりも多くのポイントを獲得していた場合最終決戦となるファイナルラウンドでの戦いでボーナスポイントをアドバンテージとして加算することができます第2ラウンドでの結果が勝敗の行方に大きな影響を与えるシステムとなっています激戦に勝ち見事優勝したアイドルには大手レコード会社との契約メジャーデビューが約束されますメジャーデビューおっと会場のボルテージは早くも上がってきているようですねアイドルたちの登場が待ちきれない待ちきれない I've been getting a lot better thanks to、uh, okay. Yakuza games. So, uh, I lost the attention for a second in that clip. I will not pay attention to the chat in a bit. I'm going to full focus on the song. You wanted it to make it harder? Fuck no. This fucking dialogue takes too long. Ready? Go! Idol Heat L1 Climax Heat on Triangle. They got double Idol Heat? Cringe. They already use both. Cringe. Out the fit to change.
Oh, I missed one. There goes my perfect score! Is this the last round? No, this is the first one. If you've done the training for her to get her max idol heaping costumes. No, I couldn't do training yet. This is literally the first round. I wasted like three hours. <clears throat> I was like wasting three hours uh, after my game crashed and doing mini games, so I had to do everything over again, and then I didn't find the courage anymore to play for a while. ファーマムラ。ありがとう。ありがとうございます。全てを出し切った。そんな感じの。いや。応援してくれたファンに一言どうぞ。こんな大勢の方の前で歌ったのは初めてだったので、すごく緊張したんですけど、観客の皆さんに選んでいただけてすごく嬉しいです。第2ラウンドも今日の gig tonight so I can't hang king. Just want to come say hi, see how grind was going. Thanks Kalmar. You have a lot of fun on your gig tonight. And uh, I'll talk to you soon. Hope you have a lot of fun. さあ、いかがでしたでしょうか。こちら会場は未だ大歓声が鳴り止みません。しかし、残念ながらそろそろお時間となってしまいました。それでは次回もお楽しみに。Credits on the background, bro. やったや、はるかちゃん。ディディディディディディディディ。そしたら、この後はまた昨日のレッスンの続きや。ただ、収録の後で疲れたやろ。ちょっと気分転換してくるとええわ。僕は先に事務所に戻ってるから。ありがとうございます。じゃあ、また事
You really are a bumpkin. How long have you been idle? In about six months. Six months? Well, I suppose there's a lot you're not used to yet. So much I am experiencing for the first time. Kind of overwhelmed. Says the girl with a smile on her face. I bet you could handle anything that came your way. It's what I've always wanted, so I'm never going to give up, no matter what. You got spunk. I'll give you that. But your body is telling me a whole other story. Health-wise, you're anything but beautiful right now. You're young, so a little rest would work wonders. Knowing you, though, I'm sure resting is the last thing you want to do. That's true. I'd really like to focus on my lessons and work. thought you might say that. So let me tell you how to lighten the load a bit. Go get some dinner at the pharmacy. It's very popular, it's very popular, but I've instructed the pharmacy to hold some for you. What's the oh. stuff called again? What's wrong with kids today? Always distracted. It's called a yin'er. Yin'er. That is a Chinese name. Hey. What does it do? It's a type of Chinese medicine that's essential in my skincare regime. I'll tell you more later, but for now, you go pick it up. I understand. But Karimashita. Lizzie panics. It's five minutes too soon. Bolsy lady. I know, right? Very bolsy. Um, there's a store there. Might as well go try to do the fishing. So with plenty of time to not be late. I'm always the same as well. I don't ever want to be late. Uh, mini games completion. Mini games fishing. We still need the ghost koi, which is Sotenbori Knight. Uh, tuna egg sandwich. And the silver arowana, also Sotenbori at night. And that is the club sandwich. Okay, it should be easy to get if I buy those sandwiches. Get here like 15 to 20 minutes after opening. I don't know how she doesn't panic. I wouldn't think about it if I were you. This is how we beat the weak. Die hard, Max. What the fuck this is? I need to talk to this guy, I guess, right? Welcome. Uh, what was the name of the Chinese medicine Yokosan wanted me to buy? Ye 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 Ren. Yinner. Do you have any Yinner here? Huh? Yinner? Yeah, Yinner. Right? Did I fuck it up already? It already fucks up all the time, so it wouldn't be too surprising. Yeah. Yes, Yoko san contacted you about it and asked me to pick it up. Mm, I didn't say it right. Oh, yes, of course. We have that ready. Ladies seem to love this. I can hardly keep it on the shelves. Phew. I thought I'd gone the wrong name. No, it was Yinner. Okay. Yinner! They, do, they just do that to make you worry. Thank you. Back to Yoko san. With the instant transmission. Ano. Picked up the Chinese medicine you told me about. Wonderful, Bumpkin. Make sure you use it on your skin every morning and every Hi. night. Okay. Why this instead of more modern cosmetics? Yeah. It's natural and relatively easily easy on the body. I don't trust some of the chemicals they want us to shelter all over ourselves. Chinese medicine is... Wonderful in any case, you can get prescriptions tailor-made for your own specific condition, you see. And all Chinese medicine helps a lady stay beautiful. I had no idea Chinese medicine could do all that. Whoever figured all this out must have had ideas similar to my secrets of true beauty. So, well, the mind and body are connected, but when they get out of whack, Chinese medicine helps restore the balance between them. But what if I want wrinkles? Who the fuck wants wrinkles? I believe a woman's beauty lies in pro producing a balance between body and mind. Keep that in mind if you want to truly learn about beauty. 
Understand, keeping a balance between the body and mind is important. That's right, come see me again if you want to keep learning the secrets of true beauty! Lizzie wants wrinkles. Learn something new every day. I look like I'm five. That's not true. I shouldn't get in the way with women yes, and their ideas about themselves. It's better to just let it go. Uh, tuna egg, tuna egg, tuna egg. Right, tuna egg and club sandwich. Sixteen, so we're doing eight, eight. Get to your house? No, you're not. <laughs> God damn it, Lizzie. Such a typical Lizzie Lizzie. Okay, time to do some fishing. Start the fishing. Club Boo Sandwich. Ikuyo? Ikuyo. La da 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 na 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 da 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 So it's bore at all times. This is a snakehead. It's also not what I'm looking for. Keep fishing. Anti, anti, pervert, pervert. Hi, Hiko. How are you this weekend? Come on, give me the... That's not what I'm looking for either. I'm back from work. Nice. How was work? Hey. Oh, I didn't catch anything. What a waste. Again? Come out of you. We'll reset it. Had to cut pineapples. Was pretty chill. You're a pineapple, ha 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 ha! Okay, sorry.
snake heads. Game, is it not yet night? It, am I fishing at evening? Is that why? Uh, you're not giving me the fish that I need. And I got wine for free! Nice! Free fucking wine, bro. It is my last club sandwich. Kusoyaro! <laughs> 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 Goy, oh, still 25k, I guess. Noise. I wish I went to the store today. Why? So that I could have gotten snacks. It's a pervert. Oh, crap. No. Grocery stores are open on Sundays. So lucky me. Yo. Yeah, but that's Germany, not the Netherlands. Ooh, what's this? It's just a black bass. Mine are open right now as well, but I don't want to end the stream. <laughs> they can probably do anything to fuck over. <laughs> Duh. How the hell did I not catch anything? Fuck you, game. I feel like I wasted my time if I don't catch anything new. New splash! Fucking turtle.
baby later. Use my takoyaki as well. Use everything. Another black bass. You duh. Urobu Sanduicha. These grapes were cold and hit the spot. Nice. Nice, Lizzie, nice. Go get some food, Hiko. Go eat something. I'm out of stuff, time to sell everything and talk to uh, Madame uh, Yoko. Misham on bridge, you'll see the guy in white outfit standing around, battle him. Hi. <laughs> Well, I like your enthusiasm, but let's get right to it, shall we? You're an idol, right, Duncan? Yes, I am. Then might I recommend you go on a diet, huh? You know what I'm talking about. I know how hungry you can get at your age. <laughs> it's true. But no excuse for poor eating habits. Right, sorry. Well, I know just what to do. I have... I'll have you pay a visit to the beauty salon that I frequent. The beauty salon? Yes. It's great. In fact, it must... It's a must for anyone who wants to maintain a girlish figure. And it's great for anti-aging treatments, too. I've never been to a salon before. Sounds expensive. Don't be silly. It only costs 80k yen. Oh, shame. Perhaps that seems a bit pricey for a pumpkin to you, like you. Well, more than a bit, actually. Tell you what. The manager there is an acquaintance of mine. And it just happens that he's hooked on dance battles. Really? Dance battles? My nose itches. I know. He should start acting his age. But in any case, aren't you into dance Hi. battles too? I am. But I don't have much experience yet. Well, if you go beat him in a dance battle, I'll ask him to give you a free treatment session if you win. Are you sure it's alright? Why wouldn't it be? I mean, you and I are really close. Would you like to know how close? Mm, no, that's okay. I'll pass. So we're going to meet him. Please tell me, Yoko-san. Now slow down, Bumpkin. You got a lot more enthusiasm once you heard it was free. He's always out in front of his shop looking for opponents. It's south of Bishamon Bridge. I don't even know which bridge is Bishamon Bridge, to be honest. This is Iwao Bridge. This is Bishamon. So we can stop by Ebisupon. La da 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 da. Irashai. Uh, we want to sell the koi, we want to sell the black bass, we want to sell the pond turtles, we want to sell the carp, we want to sell the snakehead, nishigoi, do you have anything else? We want to keep those. Why? Because I say so. Sumimasen. At least we don't run into random battles with Haruka. It's not too bad. 
front of his shop, south of... Ah, uh, there he is. To go heat up my burrito. Team Mill hasn't arrived yet. Excuse me. Oh, hello there, little lady. What can I do for you? Are you the salon manager, the one Yoko sons friends with? Yep, that's me. You must be the one Yoko-chan told me about. I am a Momiyama, manager of the salon. I'm also a head monsieur. I heard you were into dance battles. You heard right. I know I should really act my age, but I just love to dance. Can't get enough of shaking my booty, you know. Are you up for a dance battle, Haruki-san? Yes, of course. <laughs> Why are you laughing like that? You're on, and if you win, your treatment is free. Well, it's time to bust a move. Lizzie making us jealous with food again. Oh, have I actually set any of my settings yet? I don't think I have. fighting because uh, we can I don't know what other reason no way did I actually lose I I did it impressive no wonder you've made it to the Princess League finals you know about that yep been rude to TV cheering you on well thank you now get ready for the treatment of your life free of charge just as promised saying you're the stylist <laughs> or expect someone else Oh, what do you think? That that felt amazing, yeah? Well, I'm glad you liked it. I feel so refreshed in my body, I feel like a huge weight has been lifted off my shoulders. Don't mean to brag, but I'm known around the world for my work, so... Really? Yeah. But I also have a partner in Tokyo. We practice hard on each other. As a result... Sorry. But could we continue this another time? I have to go. Thank you very much. Too much information! Thanks, Haruka! <laughs> right, you're probably a little young to hear all the gory details. <laughs> TM fucking I, bro! Let's go do ba uh, input hard, health high. Mm. Let's find someone else that's not so difficult. Why are we not fighting? Because we can't fight. Arika can't fight. We need to slap. Slap fight? This girl's easy. <laughs> Just heat dance settings. Move booster, adorable lure, and charming cuteness. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
charming cuteness. Easy victory. GG. My stats are already so freakishly high though. Let me change my setup again so that we can do the last two. Uh, we didn't do X. We want to use Heartbeat. Drunk Isn't he just... he's good with his hands. It's like he's got eight of them. I'm joking, Bumpkin. Don't you have a witty comeback or something? Mm -hmm. Are we talking about a man or an octopus? <laughs> oh my, you really are a Bumpkin, aren't you? Anyway, how do you feel? feel great. Didn't realize how amazing this alone could be. Is that it? You didn't notice anything during the battle with uh, Momio-chan? You mean the dance battle? Hmm, let me think. Sensei skills are rather lacking, and that's putting it kindly. But he was just so determined, I couldn't take my eyes off him. Exactly. You don't have to be the best at what you do, but if you put everything you've got into it, people will find you quite appealing. It's confidence and passion that people find appealing. Wouldn't you agree? Yes, I think you're right. You can use idle heat in concert battles more often now. See upgrades in the pause menu. Wait, have you been tr trying to teach me that all along? Maybe I was, maybe I wasn't. But I don't know much about dancing. I've dedicated my life to seeking true beauty. Yoko-san, come see me again if you want to keep learning the secrets of true beauty. Ooh, level up. I like that, boy! Hey, what skill are we taking? Yes, please. Hi. Are those your street clothes? Well, they are rather plain, to be honest. Really? I like this outfit. Listen, Bumpkin, fans live out their dreams through artists like you. That's true. So you can never let your guard down, even off stage. You never know who might be watching. Understand? So what should I do? I'm saying you to have... Uh, I'm not saying you have to wear brand name outfits or anything. But sadly, people tend to judge books by their covers. So you need to learn how to maintain a proper appearance, make people notice how much you care about it. I understand. I have a best-selling book that explains everything you need to know. Go buy it at the local bookstore. Can't you just give me a copy? Don't be silly. I'm not one to let a sale slip by, especially to a captive market. Plus, your appeal is guaranteed to skyrocket if you read my book. It's a small price to pay. Now stop grumbling about it and go buy a copy. I bet Yoko-san book is packed with useful information. I think there was a big bookstore on Sotenbori Street East, right across the county Doru, Doraku. Try looking there. Get out of my way, Oji-san! Ah, 
Kani Dokudu. How the fuck do I even know where that is? Oh, other way. Oops, okay, hello. Told you it would sell out. Unbelievable. Sorry, I had no idea Yoko's book would sell out even at half price. Yoko's book, don't tell me. Has it really sold out? What am I gonna do now? Hmm. What about that used bookstore across uh, Iwao Bridge? It's over near the entrance uh, to the Museum of Mall. This is Iawo Bridge, right? Outdoor mall. Okay, so it must be around here somewhere, right? Revenge Books. What a bookstore name. In the, it's in the beauty section. <sighs> Guess I'm out of luck. Poor Haruka chan. Poor, poor, poor Haruka chan. I want to eat takoyaki. Yeah. Checked around all the bookstores, but it was sold out no matter where I tried. Is that right? Guess I'm more popular author than I thought. You shouldn't say one place had it on sale and the other had a used copy. Um, how am I supposed to get a copy of that book now? Fine. You can have my copy, really? Of course, it's going to cost you. Hmm, let's see. Actually, I'm kind of hungry. I could go for some takoyaki from Mugatako. They're the best. That's right. You're capable of buying some takoyaki, aren't you, Bumpkin? Okay. You ordered a 16-piece takoyaki. Okay, off you go. I brought some takoyaki! What are you waiting for, Bumpkin? Let's have it. Exactly what I wanted. You're not half bad when you put your mind to it, Bumpkin. <laughs> You're welcome. Time to chow down. That hit the spot. Here's that book, like I promised. I take you find it useful? Very. I mean, it's amazing, Yoko-san. I can't believe this person who wrote this is right in front of me. Not sure if that's a compliment or not, but I'll give you the benefit of the doubt and say thank you. Come see me again if you want to keep learning the secrets of true beauty! Okay, next. Thing, appeal, performance. Look at how high my appeal is getting. Hi. <clears throat> yes, please. Oh, I like your enthusiasm. Let's get right to it then, shall we? You're making a fair amount of progress, and your beauty is coming along. What a pure and sweet reaction, oh, Bumpkin. That was only flattering you. If you were a song, you'd be at the chorus. In other words, you still have ways to go. Feels a long way off to me. Well, anyway, sure it's cold, isn't it? I know, I'm freezing. Cold weather can be hard on the hair. 
and you're and you're living proof bumpkin. I mean, talk about hair care disaster. What? Really? You can't fool these eyes. Are you taking proper care of your hair? Hi. I mean, as much as the next girl... What did I tell you about that? As much as the next girl simply won't do. You have to take care of your appearance if you want to live in the limelight. Right. Bumpkin, I want you to pay a visit to my favorite salon. Of my hair? No, silly. Just the treatment. My hairstylist. There will turn that bird nest of yours into loveliest of logs. He's quite stuck, Muffin, so I'm sure you'll recognize him right away. Where's the saloon? Over in Show Fucho. It's called Hair Massage Love Song. It's on the same street as your agency. Okay. I'll stop by when I have the chance. Oh, make sure you bring at least 20k with you. 20,000! Ah, if only it was twenty thousand dollars. By it, didn't I? What was it called again? Love birds, hair massage, something. Ah, here it is. Love song. Malone Yokosan told me about. Got the money. Let's give it a try. Wait. It says the treatment is only six thousand yen. Why did Yokosan tell me I needed? 20,000. Welcome, what can I do for you? Oh, um, is it Silas who does Yoko-san's hair here? Ah, that would be me. Why are you so surprised? Oh no, it's nothing. Yoko-san told me about you. This way, please. This way. Well done. That will be 20,000 yen, please, huh? 6,000. Yoko-san tell you she wants me to sell you this original shampoo and leave in treatment. One bottle each. Alright then, I'll take those two. Thank you very much. So that's why Yoko-san said I need 20,000. Still 7,000 yen for a bottle sounds really expensive for shampoo and treatment. She didn't mention anything about this. I'll have to complain to her when I get back. <sighs> Yoko-san, you never mentioned anything about shampoo and treatment. Oh, so you did buy it. Thank you, Bumpkin. Thank you for what? Ooh. Tell me you didn't notice. It's right on the label, see? Oh, this is your own brand? Bingo. <laughs> These are my own special shampoo and treatment I developed with my years of experience working with hair. I keep your It keeps your hair shiny and luxurious, and my wallet flush with cash. Everybody wins. Oh, and how did you like the hairstylist I recommended? Or Studley, yeah. right? What? Guy with the suit and afro? Now that was a surprise. I mean, yeah, he was great. Could see how you two would get along just fine. I know, right? But hands off, Bumpkin. He's all mine. Hi. Sure, of course. Come see me again. Haruka is like, The fuck am I getting myself into? Okay, next one. Hi. Hi. Eh. I think it might have become a little more appealing as a woman. Well, well, confident, aren't we? Shall we put that to the test then? See what you can really do. How do I do that? I want you to go here and sing, but dress just as you are now. Then come tell me how you felt. I got hot burrito. Nice. No makeup either. That's right. Otherwise, it's not a real test. Give it a try. It's parking lot in. 
So, Fuchigo, in front of Komain. Parking lots, blah blah. Okay, so here. Here, right? We actually save in case the game crashes again. Don't want any game crashes after all. Okay, so this is the parking lot, right? Masters. Yokohan. Amiyama works is and perform. I don't know where Kamiyama works is yet. I'm pretty sure there's only one parking lot. So foku, show foku. Can I not do this one yet? This of the time and day. Walks into a shady corner as an idol. Ah. Not her dancing girl. Training sessions once. Uh, you can do them all if you wish because your final rewards infinite climax heat. Anyway, after a little office drama, that will be later. We don't care about office drama. I want to do the thing, bro. Game, let me do the thing. Why can I not do the thing? You who thing? Thing? Seriously? I can't do the thing. You know what? I'm gonna go take a toilet break, anyways. BRB. Well, we're back, and I know where I need to go now. Oh, 
Oh, here. See? This is Kagiyama's fucking... Okay. This is what Yoko-san was talking about, but am I really going to sing here? Yes. It's this piece of paper. It's no, wait, it's from Yoko-san? Dear Bumpkin, I want you to sing here in front of people who have no idea who you are. Report back to me if you're able to win the crowd over by the end of your song. P.S. Make sure you stand on the beer crate when you sing. Sing on a beer crate so I can't even dance? Hmm. Are you going to perform or something? Oh, um, well, hurry up. I don't have all day, interested man. I can do this. I just have to believe! Believe in yourself, Ziller! No dancing, just singing. Why me? Well, because uh, you said hello. So I felt like uh, dragging you into the chat. Thank you! <laughs> and then you went. That was great. You just got yourself a new fan. Oh, thank you. I hope you keep rooting for me. Believe in yourself, Sillar! Yeah, indeed. Really nailed that performance. I can feel proud telling Yoko Sunda about this. Zillar should always believe in himself. Zillar, how are you today, dude? <laughs> You're absolutely glowing. Nice work. I was really nervous at first, but I think it went really well. Did you learn anything by singing unannounced in front of people who didn't know who you are? Realize that all I've gone through has been really important in making me who I am. But I also learned how hard it is to attract new fans. True, yet you managed to do just that. Up till now, your performance have been staged to present you in the best light as a pop idol. But simply stepping onto the stage that's been prepared for you isn't enough. Whenever, wherever you are, that's your stage. Wherever you stand, I want you to place yourself in the limelight. I understand. Well, that's it. I've taught you all the secrets of true beauty now. Hmm? Is that everything? That's right. I have nothing more to teach you. It's up to you to pursue your own unique form of beauty from now on. I will. Thank you. Mention it. Besides, 
I did this for me just as much as I did for you. That's right, as I mentioned before, you remind me of someone I wasn't able to help, and that made me want to take you under my wing. By helping you, I felt like I was helping that child from so long ago, and that took just a little bit of weight off my shoulders. I'm sorry, I make it sound like I've been using you. No, it's okay. But I'd like to hear more about that person you mentioned. You're friends who shared the same dream. I was much younger back then. We were about the same age, in fact. We were both just getting started, and we promised each other we'd make it to the top together someday. It was tough going at first, but we sure had fun. But after I was hired to work with a big name idol, everything changed. Couldn't pass up such a great chance. I started getting lots of work while my friend faded into obscurity. I really wish I could have used my newfound success to pull both of us up. But back then, I was too busy with my own career to worry about others. I ended up forgetting the promise that we made. I was so engrossed in my work, I didn't even notice when my friend quit the business. That's so sad. I've regretted it ever since. How could I forget my friend like that? Why didn't I try to help? It snowballed into full-blown neuroism. Neurosism? Neurosis? Until I started to hate being a stylist. In the end, I left my career and everything I had worked for behind. You know the costume I gave you, Bumpkin? I originally made it for her, my friend. I could never bring myself to get rid of it, but I'm glad you were able to wear it. Now I can end my stylist career without a heavy heart. Yoko-san, it's been a pleasure working with you, dear, but I believe my work is done here. Maybe it's time to move on. Fun? Are you going somewhere, Yoko-san? Why wouldn't I? It's not like I am from here. Anyways, I should probably start packing up and whatnot. Me out so much. I really wish there was something I could do uh, for her before she leaves. Before she leaves. Rose the maximum. 2,000 experience points. Can I talk to her again? Hi. Isn't there something you want? Nope, nothing. I don't want you spending any more of your energy on this. I'd rather you use it, use the time to polish your skills. It's looked like she's going to tell me she wants. I wonder what would make her happy. You know, maybe Yoko's friend Mio Yama-san knows what she likes. If I remember correctly, Mio Yama should be in front of his shop over near the south end of Beishamon Bridge. It's worth a try. Dash! Speedy Gonzalez, run! I wish it was easier to check what the actual time is in the game. Oh, you're the girl Yokosan's working with. Aruka Sawamura. It's nice to see you again. <laughs> Something the matter? Or are you back for another dance battle? <laughs> no, not this time. I want to help I want your help thinking of present for Yokosan. Present? Yeah, she's been good to me. I really would like to thank her by getting her something, but I have no idea what to get her. I thought that since you were friends with her, you might know what she likes. Hmm. It's not that. You see, she's already received a gift from you. What do you mean? Didn't Yoko-chan tell you about that kid she wished she had helped? You know, her old friend? That's true. Yoko-chan told me how you remind her of her friend, and by helping you, she feels like she can finally be free of her regrets. You, along with your hard work, are the greatest gift you could have given her. Hey, hard work is a gift for yoko huh? Yep, plus you perform in that costume that was originally meant for her friend. I'm sure it made Yoko-chan very happy. That's it. Best thing I can do for Yoko, son, is to sing in that costume she gave me. Thank you so much, Momiyama san. Now I know exactly what I can do for <laughs> Yoko san. Glad I could help. And I'm glad this creepy old man is still good for something. <laughs> not least, you're not the least bit creepy. Now you'll have to excuse me, I have to run. Wait, Haruka chan, what's the rush? Said she was leaving town soon, so I want to thank her before it's too late. Hi. That's why I'm in a rush. See you later. 
Hmm, she sure is a handful. Alright, time to give back to Yoko-san with the gift of a song. Uh, running in the wrong direction. Run, Haruka, run! bump in some st someone put a bee under your bonnet I don't have anything else yeah. to teach you so no it's not it today I want to thank you for all yeah. you've done thank me don't be silly I can tell how much you appreciate my help that's more than enough sorry but I won't be able to live with myself until I've done this besides I think you're going to like this hmm? just give me a minute get ready ready or not I bumped in that costume. I can offer you as a song, so today I'm going to sing just for you in this costume. I'm going to sing my heart out for your friend who never got the chance to wear this. I'm going to put everything I learned from you into this performance, Yoko-san. Yoko-san! Now I gotta sing again. Yeah. What do you think? Still a little rough around the edges, but you gotta peel. I don't think I can even call you Bumpkin anymore. <laughs> That's a relief. Thank you so much for all you've done for me, Yoko-san. I'm never going to forget all that you've taught me, and I'll treasure this costume you gave me forever. Mm. Keep at it, and one day you'll perform an even bigger stage in my costume. Can't wait to see you do that, Haruka. Oh. Yes, he finally yeah. said my name. But oh, you have a problem with that? <laughs> Take it back. You'll always be a bumpkin to me. <laughs> Whatever you say, Yoko-san. Well, I guess I should get going. But I'm glad I was able to see you in the costume I designed for my friend. He was really special. He Yoko-san? That's right. Why wouldn't I? I mean, I was happy to see you in his costume, so... Aww. Wasn't a girl, huh? When did I say my friend was a girl? Besides... Well, look at that costume, and anyone could tell it was made for a guy. Hmm. Sure looks like a girl costume to me. Come on, Bumpkin. You have to learn to think outside the box. Get with the times, girl. Hmm. Of course. Yoko-san! Uh. Uda-san? That's right, Uda-san was Yoko-san's boyfriend a long time ago. Rudy. 
Sorry, Yoga-san. It was all my fault. I should have told you before I quit the idol business. Knew it hurt you so much. An idol? Goody! Kya! I have no idea what's going on. Oh, you never heard? This kid Yoko-chan wished she could have helped. She was talking about Uda-san. So sorry, Okasan. Please forgive me. No, it was my fault, Udi. I promised you would make it to the top together, but then I abandoned you. It was in a way. They need each other, and they accept each other as they are. And since they were more than lovers, <laughs> they might have been lovers too. Of course, there's nothing wrong with that, you know. Ah, to be young again. Oh, I'm so jealous. Uh, thank you, Momichan. Was you brought Udi here, mm. wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Heard you were leaving, and I figured you two hadn't even met up yet. But I suppose it's really Haruka, so you should be thinking. She's the one who told me you were leaving. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Haruka. Fed that monkey on my back for far too long. I feel absolutely liberated. Yes, thank you, Haruka-san. But to think, you knew Yoko-san all along, Haruka-san. This can't be a coincidence. Wait! Oh yeah, Uda-san is the manager of the fan club! Yeah! <laughs> okay, I remember. I was surprised too. I mean, I never would have expected that you used to be an um, idol. <laughs> well, that was a long time ago. I was just too competitive for it was just too competitive for me. Though Yoko-san stayed and kept fighting. Anyway, I may have failed as an idol, but I always wanted to put smiles on people's faces one way or the other. Putting on those events with you was the way was my way of doing just that. Uda-san, I have an idea. I want you to keep spreading your joy on stage. Become the idol I could never be. That's right. Never forget that you and your costume are simply brimming with Udi's, I mean, Uda-san's and my hopes and dreams. Don't worry. I'll work hard for all three of us. Good answer. And deliver with just the right enthusiasm, too. Maybe leaving town, but that's no excuse for you to slack off. And don't let me hear you've been causing problems for Uda-san or else. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you for all you've done. I'll see you around then, Bumpkin. I mean, Haruka. You can now trigger Climax Heat State at any time thanks to everything Yoko has taught you. <sighs> what a fucking... Like... Always the same stuff with these games. They just throw you one curveball after another. Like that entire... I don't even know. I don't even know. We're level 13. Okay, let's go grab some fish bait and try to catch more fish. It would be nice if we could just... If we can just finish that one off. I mean, I can wait until we can get into Purgatory for both of those, but I don't want to... Uh, let's just do a full bag of club sandwich. I can get both with the club sandwich, according to the guide. There's not much fish to catch right now. At least in the zone that the club sandwich. Got a koi! Koi! Come on, you! Got the koi! Ikuya? Only a hundred yen. Disappointed! Hmm. In 
didn't catch anything. Cringe. Did I miss? My cast didn't go where I wanted it to go. What the hell? That's not... That's the first. Won't go further down. You shit stain. Ooh. Is this uh, the ghost koi? Nice! This thing is 50, uh, 50k yen, which is very nice. Okay, that means we only need the silver arowana. Which is also the most expensive one. Fresh. Da na 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 na. Uh, at some point, we gotta do the fishing for the sea fishing as well. Not really psyched for that. Under my umbrella, Ella, Ella, hey, hey, hey. Didn't help it. I am recording again, right? Yeah, okay. Missed like an entire piece of the story. do much else until later, sadly. Uh, this is a regular koi. Up the koi, Kumarayo! Ghost boy. And a new record. Oh, I need to um, refresh. That is money, 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 money. Money that I can't use for anyone else but Haruka. <laughs> Just kind of a shame. I probably shouldn't be doing this with Haruka, but all in all, I don't really care. <clears throat> Just give me what I want, Timmy. Yeah. 
don't know what that was actually. Didn't pay attention. I bet it was Miss Silver Arowana. Let me keep throwing bait, game. This one is punk. A black bass. The black bass. all those just needs the one okay, let's go sell our fish go buy some more sandwich and try again Irashai Irashai Masain Do I even have any price to accept? No.
Let me use Google real quick. Maybe there's a better item to use. Use a five silver arrow on a... Hope food, hope sandwich, etc. for over an hour or nothing. Using the same method as the guide you mentioned. Ultimately, it boils down to a bit of luck. Ah, okay. So that's why I'm not catching it. I need to go to the other side, the south side. We might need to do this with uh, Akiyama later on anyways, because he has a very low amount of money apparently. The only other way to get money with him is, like, fighting. So I'll see when we get there. Let me save this one in my uh, guides. That's good information to keep at hand. What did he say? The takoyaki buns as bait? <laughs> Didn't catch anything, Saj. Am I? In? Yeah, let's re go in. Okay, so you can apparently do it during the day as well. It's been nice to know. We can always test it later with Akiyama. Regular koi. 
queen. Did they actually just gap that? Assholes. Does black base the base the base? Need to go grab a glass of water after this. Thirsty and hungry. Ah, there it is. And we're done. We're bailing. We got all the fishies. Exactly what we needed. Uh, might as well sell them. Let's drop everything else off here. Use the item box. いらっしゃい。お、気に。お、気に。Ah, there you are. Welcome back. Oh, by the way, Haruka-chan. Hi. Where did you get to go? I was asking for a gift. Let's go. Sorry. I'm 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 sorry. これで私たちに居所を隠してるつもりなのかな。うん、どうかした。嬉しそうな顔して。<笑>内緒です。内緒です。よし、じゃあ七時からすぐレッスンや。まずはボイストレーニング。山本さんが見てくれるから。更衣室で着替えたらいつもの四階のスタジオに行ってね。わかりました。それじゃあ。うん、頑張って。タフな仕事やなアイドルってビッチラップいいから入って Just get inside 蒼天テレビのマンダさんと大阪芸能から苦情が来てるホリエあなたがついていながらこのざまは何くだらない揉め事起こしていやその言っておいたはずよハルカを他のタレントと接触させるなって接触というかあれは言い訳は結構使えない男いいハルカはね芸能界に甘い幻想なんか持っていないのよだからこの世界の汚い部分を見れば見るほどどんどんただの仕事と割り切ってしまうでもそれじゃダメなのあの子自身があの子なりにちゃんと夢を感じられなきゃダメなのよ。I wanna scream and shout 
でもはるかの場合はそうじゃないはるかにははるかを持ち続けられる夢を持たせてあげないと意味がないの二度はないわよホリエこんなミスはこれっきりにしてはいすみませんでした、oh, I'm late. I have to hurry. No, we don't. Give me a sec. I need water. I need to hydrate. I still don't trust Park. Lady Park Chan Quad. You're late. まあこんなこと言うてる時間も惜しいわほな早速始めんでえー、な You ready? はい、はい、よろしくお願いしますよっしゃ始めようかふんやったらできるやちょっと前まで素人やったとは思えへんわありがとうございます安心しなやまだ終わりちゃうで She has the like the typical Majima and Seijima accent. Uh, well, we didn't actually need to do a minigame. I guess that's fine. Ah, Haruka chan. Ogita san o yobi ni kita yaro. Ima shachou shite de hanashite ruwa. I think I need to save in a bit, just in case. あ、ほぬかしとんちゃうぞ、くたばば。ダンスのことなんか何もわからんしろうとが。プロの仕事に口出しとんちゃうぜ。ほぎた。あんた誰に向かって口聞いてんのかわかってるのうっせい。わかった
たった今オギタをクビにしたわ。Oh, shit. そやけど、そしたらどうするんですこれでも、関西中のダンストレーナーはほとんど社長がクビにしてもて。だからやってもらいたい仕事があるのよ。人の話は最後まで聞くことね。あすみません。今、大阪城ホールのコンサートで、クリスティーナってダンストレーナーが来日してるの。詳しいプロフィールは公表されてないけどその指導で才能を開花させたスターは世界中に大勢いるらしいわここまで言えば私の言いたいことわかるわねいやし,しかしクリスティーナは自分の気に入ったダンサーにしか指導しないどうやら金や権力で動く人間じゃないらしいわねでもだからこそうちにもチャンスがあるクリスティーナを見つけてはるかを指導してもらうのよ無茶ですよ急にそんな無茶だしょ始まった言うのにホリエあんたもクビになりたいああいえすみませんやってみますやってみるそんな答え聞きたくないわやりなさいわかりましたやりますはるかあなたは大丈夫ねあはいまずは蒼天堀を歩きなさいクリスティーナは一人で前晩のように飲み歩くらしいわこの時間なら多分どこかの飲み屋ねわかりました行こうはるかちゃんすぐにクリスティーナを探しに行くんやはいまずは町で情報を集めよう蒼天堀で聞き込みやはいはいはい Yes ma'am Barksol is fucking scary. That ain't surprising. He's famous in our industry, but not so much is known about him outside of it. Actually, I've seen a picture of him once myself. What does he look like? See, in the picture I saw, he had a tan and he was wearing a pretty flashy outfit. Look the parts, you know. You think he'd stand out in a crowd, but I guess that ain't much to go on when it comes to actually trying to find the guy. Could ask around, maybe someone has seen him. True. Okay. Uh, where the blessed place to go bar hopping around here? Hmm. Watami style bar on South Bori Street are pretty famous, and Crest Bar and Hoga G's Yokocho. I'll go take a look. I'm drunk. <laughs> nice say I was. Uh, I should have gone. Uh... <laughs> My dude, how you doing? you I am okay is there a man here deeply tanned and dressed kind of flashy you're not supposed to blab about the customers but you don't look like the type who will take no for an amateur he was here really yep but as you can see he's not here anymore you mentioned that he was still wants a drink or two so he could be hoisting drinks elsewhere thank you very much goodbye I'm okay I'm okay could be worse Actually, a lot better than the past week. <laughs> Why does it need to be better than good? Whatever the fuck I want.
I'm sorry to bother you. I'm actually looking for someone. I think they might have been here. Have you seen a flashy tanned man? That guy? Yeah, he was here a little while ago, really. He said he drank so too much, so maybe he went to sober up somewhere. Thank you so much. I'll be on my way. Pfft. Fine. Fine. Whoa, Maeve, what have you been up to, bro? I kind of hate that I can't see when um, my ants are popping up, though. Painfully annoying. Hi, Haruka. Hey! Oh, Akari. Coincidence. Yeah. Mm. What's wrong? Oh, nothing. So, what are you doing? Shopping? I'm looking for a man named Christina. He supposedly has a really tan skin and wears a lot of flashy clothes. You haven't seen anyone like that, have you? Doing the same thing, living life. No way, I don't believe it. What is it? You're acting kind of funny, Akira. Christina, right? Yeah, I know him. As a matter of fact, I just saw him. Really? Sure. He was just on Sotenbori footpath. He might still be there. Come on. Live in life. ほら、あそこにいる人がクリスティーナだよ。クリスティーナさん。あれ確かあなたはさっきのダンサー。もうあなたとお話しすることはないと言ったはずですが。それは知ってます。でももう一度チャンスをください。それにほら、今度はプロも一緒ですから。プロ。どういうこと、あかり。実はさっきダンサー仲間からクリスティーナが総天堀に来てるって聞いて、私のダンスを直接見てもらったの。でも踊り終わ
You win! I shall lurk. Gonna play a bit myself. You go have fun, bro. Pencil, pencil, pencil. I don't see no pencil. Top left hand corner of the stream manager. Did they change it already? Affiliate. Where, like, I'm kind of annoyed. Where, why can I not? There used to be this funky, um, I'm pretty sure there was this easy panel that was there for the ads, but it's no longer here. At least I can't find it anymore. That actually keeps track of everything. Super annoying. Page and the stream manager panel work seamlessly together to give you the best experience. No, it doesn't. Liars. Uh. So annoying. Oh. あなたとならいいお話ができそうで、はるか。クリスティーナさん、どうして確かにはるかもよく驚いていたけど、私との差がそんなにあったとは思えない。何にどうして言ったはずですよ、あかりさん。私は興味ある何自らの心をどう表現するか。どう見る側に心を伝えられるか。それにかかっているの。私は数え切れないほどのオーディション審査し数え切れないほどのダンサーを見てきたでも毎回オーディションに落選するダンサーには共通して言えることがそれは彼らが驚く機会になってしまっているということ驚く機会一見るのズレもない計算され尽くした
何なのよそれ私の何が悪いのよあかりもう知らないもう私男子なんかしないあかり追いかけてはダメはるか今のあの子は自分で気づくしかないの辛いけどそれがあの子のためよでもあかりは間違ってないと思いますあかりは私にダンスが楽しいことだってことを教えてくれた大事な友達なんですそうなら今度はあなたが教えてあげなさい友達というのはそうやって支え合い互いに成長していける関係のことを言うんでしょえはいそうしますそれじゃお説教はこれでおしまい約束通りはるかの話を聞きましょう何か私にお仕事の話があると言ってたけどはい実はクリスティーナさんに私のダンスレッスンをお願いしたいんです私に私が所属しているダイナチアという事務所の社長がクリスティーナさんにお話なるほどそれで社長ではなくあなたが行動は言葉より雄弁ということですか<笑>結構やり手の社長さんのようですねクリスティーナさん今から一緒に事務所の方まで来てもらえませんかいいでしょうお付きいいでしょうなるほどあと数日で東京でのライブを予定しているそれまでに彼女を仕上げろとどうですかそれまでに彼女を先生のお力でなんとか形にできますかねえやっぱり無理っすかはるかにとって私はただのきっかけにすぎませんよパク社長ありがとうさすがねどういうこと踊るのはこの子です私ができるのは教えることだけ成功するかどうかは私の力じゃないご期待にお答えしてみせましょうはるかは非常に素晴らしい才能を持っているダンス歴わずか半年でここまで成長したとはまさに驚異的ですね彼女の努力も相当のものだったはずですならば残された時間は決して短すぎることはありませんクリスティーナさんはるかお願いします先生社長今日のところはこれで失礼します本格的なレッスンは明日からにしましょうはるか私もメニュー考えておきますいいですねはいよろしくお願いしますクリスティーナはやはり本物ね一つの芸を極めた一流の人間よあの先生になら安心して任せることができる二人ともよくやったわいや<笑>ただし今日の仕事はまだ終わってないえはるか着替えたら社長室に来なさい堀江も同席してあはいわかりましたわかりましたあ<笑>ブレーキー OK、done with the ads continue with story at least I can keep track of it this time this way around There you are, Hark chan. Let's go in. Hark sun's waiting for us. Hark sun!
仕事っていうのは他でもないわあなたたち今からすぐ蒼天テレビに行きなさい今日の万田さんの件よ私からもお詫びの電話を入れておいた短い時間だけどアポをもらえたから万田さんに直接お詫びしてくるのよわかりました行こうはるかちゃんはいはるか待って近くに来てあなたお化粧誰に教わったの自分で何このファンデーションの塗り方ムラだらけじゃない Your foundation is all uneven. これじゃダメよすぐにヘアメイクを手配するから次からはある程度自分でできるようにしなさいすみませんホリエすぐに手配しなさいそやけど社長今からメイク手配してたらマドさん待たせてしまうんではまったくこれだから男のマネージャーはダメねいいわなら私が直すホリエは出てなさいすみませんすみませんでした。I swear to God, Park is gonna be like an evil person at some point. あなたがうまく化粧できるようになれば、もっともっと綺麗になれるのよ。服だってもっとおしゃれなのを選ばなきゃ。今の自分で十分可愛いなんて思ってたらダメ。可愛いなんて。思ってませんん思ってなかったら少しでもマシになろうと一生懸命お化粧するはずなの見た目を少しでも良くしようと努力するものよこの世界に入った以上はもっと美に貪欲になりなさい何かおかしい嬉しいんです怒られたことはこんな風にお化粧してもらえることなんてないと思ってたからすごく嬉しいんです。女の子には母親が必要よねはるか今度流行ってるお店に連れて行ってあげるわ可愛い,い服見繕ってあげる本当ですか私は行ったことは必ず守る I always mean it. 今までもそうだったでしょ I really don't know something about park is just like But this, this is a sweet moment. So much makeup. Yep, I know, right? Hey, eyebrows. I don't have eyebrows. Jealous. Let's head out to Soten TV. Let's <laughs> Her eyebrows are close to each other. Yeah, it's not too bad, Lizzie. It's not too bad. I need to save. Like, I don't want to risk losing all my content or my shit again. Yeah, I don't. Do, can you see my eyebrows? I can't see my own eyebrows. I do have eyebrows. They're just very white, which, you know, it's just as white as my skin. <laughs> it's because they're the color of your skin. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> Ooh. 
Ura, 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 ura. Dirty doesn't have eyebrows, just skin. Listen, Zillar, I'm very hairy. If I was, if the only thing I didn't have was my eyebrows, that would be very, very weird. Erica Chan, are you ready to go? Yes. All set. Okay, off we go then. Let's find Manda Sun. Manda Sun. Manda Sun. Ah, the people from Dynachair. We were terribly sorry about earlier today. Our sincerest apologies. Oh, right there. Pardon? Good timing. You two, this is perfect, huh? Well, we had that famous model. I can't seem to remember her name scheduled to go on our game show, but she's up and cancelled last minute. The studio is in uproar, but here you people come along like a gift from above. What do you say? Think you can take her place, young lady? What? Yes, of course. Haruka's uh, schedule is open for the rest of the day. You think Haruka chan can you do it? He said it's some sort of game show. Sure, let's go! You just want to go home. I just want to go home. Lizzie, go home. Yes, of course, I'd love to go home. Great, that's the spirit. Hey, Hayashida, I found Philin. Hey, you're Haruka Sawamura. Whoa, aren't we lucky? All right, let me explain how it's going to go. Right this way, if you would. Yes, of course. I just want to go home. I am home. But once I get home, you got things to do, right? Celebrate my niece's birthday. Aww. Hello, Saramura san Thank you for coming. Hello. Thank you very much for having me. Ever watched the show you're going to be on today? No, sorry. Haven't. Right, then let me give you a brief rundown. Sotan Bori Love Check Quiz is a late night quiz show. As the title suggests, the show features trivia questions about Sotan Bori and tests the comp Contestants love for the town. Hmm, I see. The questions are all multiple choice with only two options. You hold up the O or the X sign to choose your answer. You're free to do anything you want until recording starts. All right, thank you. Should I make sure I understand how the show is going to work? Yes, I think it better. Okay, uh, X is false. I guess, and the other one is good. Of 10 seconds to answer each question. If you don't answer within that time, it will be counted as an incorrect answer. Your goal is to answer at least seven questions correctly, but if you manage to get all 10, the reward's greater. Yeah, I got it. Recording will start Hi. soon. Are you ready? Yes, I am ready. Birthdays are not nice, Sillar. Saramura-san, as a first-time guest on the show, would you like to say a few words before we begin? Oh, I am, I've am. i never done this before, so I'm really nervous, but I'll do my best. Sounds like you should do your best to calm your nerves. <laughs> anyway, let's get started. Sotenbori Love Check Quiz Begin! Soten Hori, that's false. Yatta! Excellent! I hope you can keep up the good work. Now, on to the next question. There are no parks in Soten Bori. Is this true or false? This is false! The name of Harkasaurus Teletology's Dino Chair. Is this true or false? Wait. It's Dyna chair, right? <laughs> At Dyna chair, Argosaur has her lessons on the fourth floor. True or false? True! There are no arcades! It is false! Bubbler, do you 
tea set that is true. There is a karaoke joint in Sotenbori that is false. Bun takoyaki and taiyaki shop that is false. Only takoyaki and I want takoyaki. Oh shit, oh my stomach is dying, yay! Excellent, I hope you can keep up the good work. Now on to the next question. Wow, old bridge, I'm dying. That's nice, no, or should I say that's niche, no. Niche? I will see myself out after the joke, god damn it, Zillar. Why, stomach? Why? Oof. You got all 10 questions correct? I did it! All 10 questions correct, you win the title, Stoughton Bori Fanatic! And 30,000 yen! Jeez, I'm literally dying here, thank you very much! So that's it. Join us next time on Sotenbori Love Check Quiz. Ugh. Someone save me. Fantastic job, Harukachan. I was a little nervous. Well, it didn't show. You released it out. Thank you. Anyway, let's go see Manda san again. Alright. いいでしょう。今日のことは忘れます。パク所長には昔お世話になったギリもありますしね。ええ、こちらこそ飛んだ失礼を。本当にすみませんでした。ま、この話はもうなしにしましょう。それよりな、はるかちゃん。そのメイク自分でやったん?あ、いや、これは社長に。そうですか、パクさんが。あ、だい。いや、あの、いまいちですかね。いや、全然いいよ。そうやなくて、はるかちゃんを見てるとな、昔のパクさんを思い出すなって
So it's the nah. Ba -da -ba -da 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 -da. Very sun's right. It was quite a day. Go hurry home, get some sleep. Do I actually have damage? No, I don't. So we can start the side quest, but we can't actually finish it yet until tomorrow. Tatsuya Haruka. What you smiling about, Lizzie? Fucking Zully. Hey, 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 you can't just go and fuck Zully, Lizzie. <laughs> well, it'd be kinch to fight a great place here in South of Bori, but there are just too many to choose from. I'd like to try some more, but I'm already stuffed. But I already did. Oh no! I've seen that guy on TV, I wonder what he's doing here. Oh, I'm so full, I think I'm going to throw in the towel. Excuse me, are you alright? Hmm. Oh no, don't worry about me, I'm fine. Oh good, I was wondering. Haven't I seen you on TV before? You probably have, I'm Tatsuya. I'm something of a celebrity chef. I'm Haruka Sawamura. So you're the guy who shows up, shows people quick and easy recipes, right? I'm glad you heard of me. Makes all my hard work worth it. They say kids today don't watch much TV, so I'm always glad to meet one who does. Actually, I've been on TV too, so I'd like to watch other shows to see what they're like. Ooh, are you a celebrity or something? You could say that. I'm a pop idol. But I'm not very famous. I'm afraid I don't know much about music. I'm more chef than celebrity, you see. I almost didn't recognize you without your chef uniform. So you're not on the job now? Actually, I sort of am. I'm on the show where we try to help eateries across Japan by coming up with my own versions of local dishes. I've been going around trying to... trying the local fare in order to come up with new ideas. Oh, so that's why you're so full. You really looked like you were in pain. Yeah, it's tough trying to cover so much ground on my, by my lonesome. It would really help if I had someone who could recommend great places. Hey. What about you, Harkachan? Do you know any good places to eat around here? Good places. I was hoping you'd let me know if you ate anything that served really tasty f local fare. Hoping that if you try it, if I try it myself, I'll get some ideas for a new dish. Is anywhere that serves local dish fine? Anywhere is fine. But since you're underage, let's avoid places that serve alcohol. I'll ask someone else about a place like that. Okay. If all you need is some recommendations, I'll be glad to help. Great, thanks, and don't worry. I'll make it worth your while. I'll give you some advice on making everyday meals yummier and fun. You won't regret this. Ooh, sounds great. I can hardly wait. Lizzie, stop! <laughs> You're making me hungry! Near Bishamon Bridge. Okay, since we don't have a good way of actually taking damage right now, we're just gonna go on to the next day. Never, she says. I'll remember that, Lizzie. I could order a milkshake. No! Why? Why are you killing me, Lizzie? Why are you doing this? Lizzie must hate me so much. <laughs> Timmy! <laughs> that was good sleep. Okay, I better get to the office for my lessons. We get a shit ton of sub stories now unlocked as well. Oh, an email from Akri. From Akri. 
Do you mind taking her? Long time no see. My dancer friend has been bugging me about having a dance battle with you, Haruka. Would you mind taking her on for me? She said she'll be waiting near a tree on Sotenbori footpath. It's right behind Subo Raya. I know you're busy and you probably better things to do, but I appreciate the help. I do want a chance to try and make it up to Akri for the other day. So there's Sotenbori footpath somewhere behind Subo Raya near the trees. Got it. I'll check it out. These are all the side quests. Uh, we're first going to make a little bit of progress so that we can get some free time afterwards. Uh, no, you know what? We're going to actually do the side quests that we can do right now. Oh, I'm running in the wrong direction. Everything else will come later. I bet I'll lose some HP during all of this. Tatsuya, the letters. Wonder how everyone's doing back home. I miss it. Oh, that's right. Yamaura-san said I have an interview with Okinawa Tourism Magazine. I'm so busy I nearly forgot. Oh, got an email. It's Ayako, Morning Glory. Thanks for the money, Ayaka. Don't overdo it, okay? We saw you on TV the other day. All of us at Morning Glory were thrilled. They're all watching me on TV. That's so nice. Makes me happy, even though it's kind of embarrassing. They're right back. So glad to hear from you. Is everything okay back home? Back already? He's getting good at this email thing. Thanks, but we're fine. We're as happy as ever here. How about you? Wanna send you some Goya? Hell yeah, sounds like nice. Not the HP, yes the HP. Not to worry, of course, I don't want them to worry about me now. And thanks, I'm good on Goya. Soon I'm going to do an interview for Tourism Mag. Maybe you'll all get to read it. That'll excite them. Here we go. So the interview the one where you answer questions from readers. Make sure you do a good job. Being so pushy. Just tell her, okay, thanks Ayako work now. Talk to you later. Love, Haruka. You to hear everything's alright back home. Last message was weird though. Uh oh. It's time for the interview. Better hurry to Bunzia Outdoor Mall thingy. Madingy. It's 9pm. I swear to god this is so bad for my health. I really want to just go and... Order food. Wait a minute, aren't you? Pardon? It is you, I knew it. Sawamura-san, right? I am Fuyumoto. Surely you've heard me. Very sorry. I'm afraid I haven't. It's funny. I'm on TV a lot, but I suppose you're much too busy to watch TV. See you on the Princess League, by the way. Anyway, I'm producing a special event right here in Sotobori. The main goal of the event is to provide for the audience an intense, exciting battle between idols, life and in person. We gather nearly 100 idols together in one spot and have them perform. Rate them by voting. Hmm, sounds similar to the Princess League, yes. But what sets this event apart is that everyone can come to see the whole thing live. Live? Not pre-recorded? That's right, 99 idols battling it out on a Sotenbori stage. The event is called Sotenbori Battle Royale 9090 or SBR 9090 for short. Sure. Short. Concert event. 
and handshake event. All three of these are on easy mode. Hmm. Okay. Heard of that, but I didn't know it was the name of the event. <laughs> yes, many people are under the mistaken impression that it's the name of a group. Anyway, I'm glad you heard of it. I just compete in three categories, dance battle, concert event, and handshake event. The audience then votes on those performances. And now, to come to the point, do you think you might be interested in competing in the SBR 99 this summer? Or who? Me? That's right, I'm sorry to ask you like this on the streets after a chance meeting, but I think it must be fate. What do you think? It's a high-profile event, and I believe taking part in it could be good for publicity. Hmm, well... And not only that, but I also think it would be a chance to grow as well. Chance to grow? That's right, as mentioned before, SBR 99 takes place before a live audience in this competition idols get the experience of the pressure of the direct audience voting to a little friendly competition what better environment to help an idol grow i'm sure you'll find the experience of battling it out with other idols of your generation in such an exciting event to be truly enriching hmm. it does sound like it could be good experience most definitely so what do you say would you like to take part it's actually going on right now you could start immediately. What should I do? If I lose, that could cause problems for the agency. Let me give you some advice. I firmly believe it's better to try something and regret later than regret not trying at all. And I would say that all of the young ladies taking part in SBR 99 right now feel the same way. So how about it? Yes, let's go. Hi. Alright, thank you very much for asking me. I think I'll give it a try. Wonderful! I'm very glad to hear it. Your agency is Dyna Chair, is that right? Contact them myself to make the proper arrangements. Now, if you'll come right this way. Never trust a random stranger on uh, the street, guys. It's for the event here. One of the staff will come notify you once it's your turn to go on. Okay. And shake, blah, 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 blah. you'll be facing off against an opponent. If you're wondering who the opponent will be, that'd be me, right, Fuyamoto son? <laughs> right, you are, Ayumi. Hello, Sawamura san, I've been watching you on the Princess League. Today, SBR 99 should prove to be pretty interesting, don't you think? Meet Ayumi Domoto. She's one of our most popular participants, regularly voted number one. Thought she'd be a good matchup for you. It's very nice to meet you, Ayumi-san. Listen, just because you've gained a little fame on TV, don't think that's going to help you here. SBR 99 fans are pretty selective. They aren't swayed by money or connections. They don't care about talent. Pretty brave to come waltzing in here. I just hope you don't regret it once the votes are counted. Okay, now Ayumi, please don't be rude. I was the one who had to persuade Sawamura-san to join us today here. Doesn't mean you want me to hold back, does it? No, of course not. As a matter of fact, it would be downright disrespectful to Sarah Murison. <laughs> well, good. As long as I know it's all right to do my best. I can relax and focus on my performance. I hope you aren't very upset, Sarah Murison. I'm sure Ayumi only speaks this way because she's fiercely proud of her accomplishments here. But that's just the kind of keen competitions, competitive spirit that SBR99 breeds. And it's all the better for it, I believe. Hi. I'm not upset. I would have expected nothing less. I'm glad to hear you say that. I have a feeling today's competition will be more exciting than any other. Well, we'd better let you get ready. Your turn will be coming up. Today on SBR 99 we have Haruka Sawamura-chan of Princess League fame joining us for the first time. So get ready for an exciting battle. Going up against Haruka is our SBR 99's own ace Ayumi Domoto in an intense head-to-head -head competition. As always the audience will vote as the idols compete in three categories. Dance battle, concert event and handshake event. Now then without further ado it's time for Sotenbori Battle. Royale 99. We'll start with Dance Battle. Good luck to our competitors. Yeah. <laughs> 
あグラン<笑> Splendid, just splendid an incredible battle between two well matched opponents. It appears clear these girls are vying for the top two spots out of the 99. Hey, you did better than I expected. I thought your popularity might have just been a fluke. But now I see you really know your stuff. You can see why you're in the SBR 99 Ace. Just getting warmed up. Wait till you see what I can do next. The showdown between these two young idols continues. Next up is the concert event. Are you ready? Now, without further ado, let's get started! Oh, I missed something. Timing was off. Can't believe I missed my combo! Boom. Ad starts in one minute, ten seconds. Such wonderful performance, I think I nearly forgot to breathe. It's easy to see why Haruka Sawamura is doing so well in the Prince League. Will become of the other SBR 99 challengers if our new contestant walks away with the top spot. First try. It will all be up to you, the audience, to cast your votes and decide. And what's more, the competition isn't over yet. There's still one more SBR 99 category to come! It's time now for the handshake event. Let's see how much warmth and enthusiasm our idols greet their fans with. Being an idol isn't just about technical skill, after all. Heartfelt appreciation for their fans is every bit as important, if not more so. Now then, on to the handshake event. Go over the handshake procedures to get started. Nah, we don't need to. I think we uh, we good we good fam. Oh wait, this is the. Oh, I should have kept. This. Wait. いいね、おいしな。そんなことないですよ。はるかまず俺のよ。ありがとうございます。ちょっと待ってね。かわいいっす。本当ですかいいね。頑張ります。ありがとうございます。I'm okay. back. Welcome back, Lizzie. よろしくお願いします。会えてよかった。We got so many fans. Ad starting soon. Ad is taking too long to start. Yeah. <laughs> 
Beep. 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 You're so sweet, babe. Finished. And that concludes the handshake event. Thank you very much, Haruka-chan. You handled that with such poise and grace, captured the heart of the audience, and it looks like many of your fans were able to bask happily in the warmth of your handshake. Thus concludes the three categories the SD of the SBR99, the event that brings idols and fans together. Voting has begun here in the event hall. We ask for your patience as we tally the votes. Did everyone enjoy today's Sotenbori Battle Royale 99? SBR 99, an intense battle between idols unfolding right before your very eyes. And today certainly has been just that. I will now announce the results. Now then, bringing up the rear in 99th place, we have... Like, first place is either going to be you or me. I underestimated you at first, Harakachan, but I have to admit, you're head and shoulders above the rest. Don't know about that. I still have a lot to learn. On top of everything else, you're a nice person too. Anyway, let's see what the results say. No matter who wins, we won't hold grudges, agreed? Of course not. Agreed. Says that and then, then jumps on my shoulders and is like, How dare you beat me? Ah! Something like that. Did he sniff his hands? No, I'm not sniffing my hands. My nose has been very itchy. And now we finally come to our top two competitors. Who will be number one and who will be number two? Right here, the voting results coming in second today is Ayumi Demoto. That means Haruka Sawamura is number one. Oh, I lost. Well, it looks like you're the big winner today, Haruka-chan. Go ahead and step forward. You win, Haruka-chan. Please step forward and say a few words to our lovely audience. Oh, okay. Thank you very much for, to everyone who voted for me today. And, of course, whether you voted for me or not, thank you very much for participating in today's Sotenbori Battle Royale 99. This was the first time I ever tried SBR 99, and it was absolutely wonderful. I'm really glad we got to spend this time together. Thank you. Smooth talker. She's so smooth. I appreciate your joining us today, Sawamura chan. We certainly had an exciting SBR 99 today, thanks to you. Thank you very much for inviting me. I'd love to ask you to come back again someday, but first, I have a proposal for you. Proposal, what is it? Well, this is difficult to ask of you, but would you ever consider leaving Dynachair? What? I'd like you to join a talent agency I run, you see. To leave Dynachair? I know it's very forward of me to ask, please forgive me. And said, yes, I have a plan to someday form a group from all the SBR99 top performers. That's my ultimate dream, you see. It's why I've been talking to all the winners of SBR99 just as I'm doing with you right now. What do you say, Saramura san? Would you ever consider it? I'm sorry, but I'm afraid now not. NHR has made me what I am today. I'm very grateful to them. I was afraid you'd say that. I heard that you were discovered by Dynachair Press Dynachair President and that you came all the way from Okinawa. With all that in mind, I didn't think it very likely that you would say yes, haha. <laughs> Still, after seeing your talent, I had to at least make an effort to ask. I hope you can forgive me. In that case, maybe we'd make this your last SBR 99, so I won't be tempted to ask you again. Here's your performance fee. Thank you again for taking the part. I look forward to seeing what you'll do. I imagine even my all-star group will have a hard time keeping up with you. Sounds like I better watch out. Haha, <laughs> indeed. Well then, good luck to you, saramura san I'm glad we had this chance to meet. To boss. <laughs> eh. Feel like a fucking cat today.
with a showy backflip. Nanya sore. Konario. Quite a lot of side quests to do. The announcer school. Serious? <laughs> Let me through! Oh, hello. Are you interested in broadcasting communications or becoming an announcer? Our school will give you specialized training. We're the Sotenbori Announcer School, and right now we're offering a free introductory class. A free class? <laughs> That's right, more than 90% of the students who've graduated from our program have landed broadcasting or other voice-related jobs. We put together a rich curriculum which trains the broadcasting students in enunciation, intonation, diction, and proper language usage. Are you interested in becoming an announcer? Me, not really, no. Our course it's perfect for anyone who wants to work in a voice-related field, voice actors, TV-related talent, narratives, presenters, etc. I see. Hmm. Those skills sound like they might be really helpful in my line of work. Would you at least like to try our introductory class? It's completely free. You can even take it right now, if you have time. Try the class. Wonderful! Suvrashi! Thank you for coming. The class will begin momentarily. Am I the only student? Yes, I'm afraid no one else has expe expressed an interest at the moment, but you're in luck. You receive all the teacher's attention. Hello there, sorry to keep you waiting. I am Gusa, the headmaster of the school. Well, what a pretty young student you have found as uh, Fujimoto-san. Forgive me, I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? My name is Fujimoto, and you are? Oh, my name is Haruka Saramura. <laughs> Pleasant voice our young student has, and our curriculum could help you polish and refine your speech qualities in fern. Now then, Segusa-sensei, if you would start the lesson. All right, Saramura-san. It looks like you're the only one here, but let us begin, Hi. shall we? Yes, please. We'll begin with the lesson of proper language usage. As you know, many people are guilty of misusing language in their everyday lives. Of course, this doesn't pose much of a problem when speaking to friends or family, but it won't do for an announcer speaking on national TV. How embarrassing would it be to make a mistake when speaking in front of millions? That would be embarrassing, would it? This brings us to your first problem to consider. I will give you three sentences. You tell me which of them contains a mistake. So I choose the sentence as incorrect. Precisely, here we go. Hmm. Uh, this one. Laisha and me did our homework together is incorrect. That is correct, very good, Saramira-san. Oh, you're quite good at this, aren't you? I don't think that one was all that difficult, perhaps. But I believe a lot of people wouldn't have known the answer. The people who did their homework are the subject of the sentence. So the pronouns should be in subjective form. I, not me. You do hear that kind of thing quite a lot though, don't yeah. you? Yes, it's commonly used and readily understood, but still incorrect nonetheless. Let's continue on to the next problem, shall we? Now then, which one of these three sentences is incorrect? If I'd known, I would have done it differently. Wonderful! Subrashi! <laughs> so glad. Please explain what the mistake is. I'm afraid I'm not sure myself. I'm appalled. How can you claim to represent our school with such a shaky understanding of the language? Please forgive me. It should be would have, not would have. People do misinterpret would have as would have. 
fairly often in colloquial speech. I don't fucking know that word. Interesting, isn't it? Let's keep going, shall we? Now that which of one of these is mistaking? I wouldn't be able to tell this shit. I think it's number one. I accidentally took the wrong bus. It is incorrect. I see. What makes you say that. It should be accidentally, not accidentally. Wait, accidentally. Uh, this must be something where my dyslexia is like, uh, pfft, I don't fucking know. Well done. You're exactly right. I'm very impressed, Sawamura-san. Thank you. That's enough of an introduction to proper language usage. There are other skills that need to be cultivated as well for voice-related work. You're a very bright student. Proper language usage, aren't you? You got all the problems correct, after all. Hmm. Yes, I'm starting to worry there isn't much we can teach you. <laughs> But Sagus uh, Sensei, surely there must be something else. Uh -huh. No, you're right, of course. There is plenty more to learn. Plenty. Let's move on to the new topic, shall we? Now, through the use of tongue twisters, we'll practice speaking rapidly yet clearly. An essential skill for an announcer. Tongue twisters. <clears throat> Clear enunciation and fluency are essential for any voice-related work. Third, then first. Okay. You ready to start? I'll give you a tongue twister and you'll say it as fast as you can. First, first, second. Thank you. That one was just a warm up, however, on to the next tongue twister. I can't read that fast. If I hadn't, like, have the fucking answers right here, I would fail this one miserably. Now, this last one should prove quite difficult. Are you sure you're ready? Big finish. This one is a little less common. Have you heard of it before? Here goes. Many an anemone see an enemy anemone. Colorful sea creatures with the tentacles, right? Anemone sees an enemy anemone. Three. Three. You got it exactly right. That was incredible, Sawamura-san. Can't believe it either. I'm so happy. I'm very impressed. You must have a natural aptitude for this sort of thing. That concludes our introductory class. Thank you very much for coming today. Thank you for such an interesting lesson. I yeah. really want to recommend that you enroll in our school. Nevertheless, Sawamura-san, it would seem you got all of our practice problems perfectly correct. I'm afraid you've left me without a way to persuade you to join. I'm very sorry. After Sengusa Sensei gave you this introductory lesson for free and everything. Sorry, Ms. Fujimoto. I'm afraid there really is nothing left for me to teach Sawamura son. Next time, I hope you can bring me a student who requires a bit more help. <laughs> yes, I'll do my best. They seem like such nice people. I feel kind of guilty. But at least now I can have confidence in my speaking skills. Smooth. <laughs> At least they're not bad people <laughs> trying to uh, tie me down. Oh, it's Uda-san from Sotenbori Merchandi Merchants Association. Hello, Uda-san. What brings you here? Oh, Saramura-san, what a coincidence. Do you think you could spare a minute or two? There's something I'd like to show you. Take a look at this photo of me. I saw a junior high school student with it on the street, but I know for a fact it didn't come from Dinah Chair. Someone stalking and secretly taking pictures of you, then selling those picture photos without permission. Taking pictures of me? Honestly, I had no idea. The work of a paparazzo? Is that is that uh, how you say it? Okay. No doubt. I suppose that sort of thing happens to many idols. 
the Merchants Association just can't allow it. It would damage our reputation to have no authorized photos like this on, on being sold on the street. I want to get this uh, no good creep out of town, and I'd like you to get your cooperation. If you may. What can I do? Well, this paparazzo might be pointing his camera lens at you from the shadows. Very moment. That's how close he might be at any given time. So if you ever get the feeling someone is watching you, it might very well be this paparazzo. Please be vigilant at all times, especially on the street. And if you happen to notice paparazzo, could you please give me a call? I'll drop everything and come running. Well, Dinochair really should be the one looking into this. But yes, of course, I'll do what I can to help. Wonderful. Just promise you won't try to apprehend him yourself. We don't know what kind of man we're dealing with here. He could be dangerous. All you have to do is call me. I'll take care of the rest. All right, thank you. Stay vigilant and take care. Thank you, saramir son. I'm getting this funny feeling I'm being watched. Must be somewhere nearby. Find the paparazzo who's secretly taking pictures of Haruka. But take one step and he'll realize you're onto him and run away. Without moving from the spot, press R3 to switch to first person view and look around for the paparazzo. Motherfucker! There, that must be him. I better call Uda san. Here, is that you, Sam? Yes, I found the paparazzo. He's wearing a fishnet vest. Great work. What is he doing right now? Oh no, he just took off. It looks like he's heading towards West Show Fukucho. Don't let him out of your sight. All right, I won't. Better get after him before he gets away. Uh. Lizzie! Timmy! Why do you gotta be like this? Already hungry! It's not my fault. What do you mean it's not your fault? You could not tell me about it. <laughs> that makes it very much your fault. <laughs> they keep feeding me. some point think they're gonna cook me and eat me <laughs> uh, fitting for the church if you ask me oh, we got him nice going sorry my son I'll never do it again just let me go never noticed that someone was following me and taking pictures no idea right you wouldn't believe the lengths to which we go to stay unnoticed it's practically an art art I'll give you arts. I'm kicking you out of this town. If I see you here again. I'm calling the police. Understood? Understood. Thank you very much for your help, Sarumura san. Of the entire merchant association, I'd like to give you this small token of our appreciation. And it, buddy. Now get lost and never come back here again. Yes, sir. Money! There's another side quest there, but we're not doing that one yet. I'm first gonna go all the way to the other side. Plus that is probably more than a minute for the ad to be done.
level in my 14. Damn, it's really unhealthy. I just want to order some food right now. I really, I really shouldn't be ordering food. Why do you keep bumping into people? Because people don't get out of my way. And I, uh, that's where the magazine interview is. And I am not in the mood to run past people. And there are way too many people. Hello, I'm Haruka Sawamura. It's very nice to meet you. Welcome to Ryukyu Travel Publishing. I'm Yara. Are you from Okinawa? Born and raised. Hi, huh? you could tell from my name. Yes, now I feel like I'm <laughs> back home. It's great. <laughs> Make for an excellent interview, don't you think? I certainly will. Poor Yordi. Yeah, poor me. Poor me! We wanted to make this unique, so we asked Okinawan children to write you letters for the <laughs> magazine. The response was overwhelming. The greatest volume of mail we've ever received, in fact. It must be quite celebrity there. Are we just not fighting? Yeah, this is literally... The entirety of Haruka's thing is purely minigames. Minigames, minigames, rhythm games, minigames. There is no fighting whatsoever as Haruka. Space for the article is limited, so we picked just three letters. I'll read them to you. You can comment. Sounds good? Absolutely. All right. The first letter is from a sixth grade boy named Professor Cosmos. That's a pen name, I assume. <laughs> yes. All three letters are written under pen names. I guess Professor Cosmos is a big fan of outer space, huh? Anyway, here we go. Dear Salomir son, I saw you dancing on TV. Whoa, you're so cool. I'm not athletic like you. I can't even do one pull-up and the other kids make fun of me. What should I do? I had the same problem when I was a kid. So, any advice for Professor Cosmos? Prove them wrong! I would tell him that I'm sorry the other kids tease him. But why not turn those hurt feelings into inspiration? He said he liked my dancing. Well, when I first started, I couldn't dance well at all. It took so much practice. My dance coach would probably say that I'm still not good enough, even now. But the important thing is to learn something new and just feel good about that. So my advice is to just keep trying. Very wise. I think Professor Cosmos will be encouraged by that. I'm getting a Polish... and the burger from this really good food restaurant for the party. Oh... Damn it, Lizzie! Can we stop talking about food? <laughs> now then, on to letter number two. This is from I Heart Riona, a middle school boy. Never! <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, that pet name caught me by surprise too. What a romantic fellow. Okay, now a boy who has a crush on a girl named Riona. Could it be Mitsuo? Professor Cosmos said he had, was in sixth grade. Could that be Shiro? Some remember some? Oh, sorry. Going to be chocolate cake. No, I want chocolate cake. Here's what it says. Dear Haruka, I've been watching you on TV and rooting for you, but I kind of get jealous of everyone else on TV. They're all so good looking. There's a girl I like, but I don't think she likes me. Do you think it's because I'm not very handsome? He's rooting for you. Must be a big fan. <laughs> he sounds like a passionate guy. As far as romantic dilemma. Uh, I'm dying here, Lizzie. Sure, looks are a big part of what first attracts us to a person. An entertainment business certainly puts an emphasis, um, emphasis, I can't fucking pronounce for shit, on looks, that's for sure. But they aren't the only thing. When a person truly likes someone, it has much more to do with personality, I think. For example, how kind the person is, how trustworthy, character can play a big role in a bigger role than appearance. AV coming in with the resub. Craig no, I have literally nothing. AV, thank you very much for the resub, dude. How are you doing? I got literally nothing. Even in the entertainment industry, it counts for something if you're attractive on the inside as well as not the outside. Trying to say is, if you really like this girl, show her the quality of your character. See what happens. Good luck. 
I do have milk, but that doesn't fill. It's very nice. I'm sure your words will mean a lot to iHeart Riona. Now for the third and final letter, it's from Dragon Mask Man, a boy in his second year of middle school. I'm out of chocolate powder though. <laughs> I also need to do a shit ton of dishes. I'm not sure if you can see it, but... Uh, is there something wrong? Oh no, it's nothing. I misheard you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dragon Mask, <laughs> that has to be Tai Chi. All three of these letters are from Morning Glory for sure. I see why Ayoka, Ayo, Ayako, Jesus Christ. I'm neutral. I mean, that's better than bad, so I guess that's good. Told me to do a good job at this interview. Um, are you ready to continue? Oh, yes, please, my apologies. <laughs> How do you do so, Murasan? Always watch you when you're on TV. You're the main topic of conversation at our house. We used to have people who were like a mother and father to us, but they both left on long journeys. Now I'm the oldest boy, so I've been trying to be responsible and dependable like they were, but it's not easy. What can I do to become more like them? He sounds like a very mature, thoughtful young man. Wise beyond his years. Any advice for him, Saramura son? Just keep doing what you've been doing. Yordi's having a stroke. Yordi's always having a stroke. <clears throat> Sounds like you've been doing great. Just keep at it. I'm sure all the younger children look up to you because you already have those virtues you admire in the two people who left. Besides, those two weren't perfect. They made all kinds of mistakes. So don't worry about what you can do now. You're already helping your family a lot. Well, Saramura san. Oh, I I'm yeah. sorry, I. No, please don't apologize. I think I think Dragon Mask Man really needed to hear something like that. We'll print exactly the way you said it. No edits. Oh, wonderful. Super dash. Those were some fantastic answers. Thank you for coming. Thank you very much for having me. You gave some fantastic answers. I'm sure the children who wrote the letters will be thrilled. I hope so. Um, would it be possible for me to read the rest of the letters that were sent in? Oh, sure. I actually have them right here. Shall I have them sent to your agency? No, I'd like to take them with me now, if that's all right. Are you sure? That's a lot of heavy paper to carry around. It's okay. I'm stronger than I look. <laughs> you got it, then. Here's some compensation for your time. Compensation. Thank you. We hope to have you back soon. I'd like that very much. Whoa. What's the letters in these bags? I'll be sure to read and answer every last one of them. His pen names were so silly. <laughs> they really think I wouldn't figure out their true identities? Remind me of someone else I know. They couldn't talk to me directly, so they wrote letters. <laughs> They're cute. Just like you, you hun. Lizzie. Lizzie, 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 I'm gonna write you a letter. Then you first need to have my address. Also, I don't read letters, so, uh... <laughs> The pen name Jizzy. <laughs> God damn it. Uh... Hey, hey, you, hold it right there! Holy shit, what the fuck is with this character model? Me? Yeah, you. What do you think? Who do you think? You're Haruka Sawamura, aren't you? Yes, that's right. Um, do I know you? What? You're trying to be the top idol and you don't even know who I am? You'll never figure it out. I'm Ulala, the daughter of legendary beauty from the neighboring town. Um, so your mother is a legendary beauty? My mother is, and I am too. They always told me I'd be beautiful when I grow up, and as you can plainly see, I am. I... <clears throat> what is... What is this side quest exactly? Autographing session. 
Uh, not that one. Not this one either. Magical Haruka, not that one either. Light and dark, normal life. Where's her? Yeah, like. But if you think you can be an idol around here and not know who I am, you got another thing coming. We idols are very particular, you know. Very sorry, I still have a lot to learn. Exactly. And don't you think you've been letting your success get to your head lately? You're not even that cute. But you suddenly get a few fans and now you're all full of yourself. Show offs like you make me absolutely sick. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to come across that way. I've seen you with your snotty smug look on your face, twisting and gyrating all over the stage, doing those dance battles, or whatever you call them. Huh, you should be drowning downright embarrassed if you ask me. A potato make a better dancer than you. Wait, so you're... Okay. I was just informed I gotta stay until 7 on Tuesday. No, Lizzie, poor Lizzie. Uh, so, Ulala thinks she's a better dancer because she's a potato. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what I did wrong, but I'm sorry if I did something to upset you. Truly, I am. Ha! <laughs> One itty-bitty apology isn't going to cut it, sister. Um, I came all the way to Sodenpori only to find everybody making big fuss over little nothing like you. What a joke! What do you call those things again? Dance battles? Okay. Then let's see you do one right now. I, the great Ulala, will be your opponent. What? <clears throat> you want to have a dance battle with me? That's right. What, is there something wrong with your hearing too? Oh, you make me so mad. Huh. <laughs> but that's all right. You'll get yours when I completely annihilate you in front of everybody. Unless you're too scared to take me on. That is? I mean, who could blame you for thinking you... <sighs> Fucking damn it. <laughs> um, take her on, obviously. Great, just try not to cry when I beat you. <laughs> this fucking. What the fuck is wrong with this model? Like. I, <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ, bro. Ooh, we open up Revelations. Oh, I completely forgot about that. Did I mention? No, yes. I lost after the performance I just gave? How could I have lost? Urgh. How could a little stick like you possibly beat me? It doesn't make any sense. I've worked so hard on my wardrobe and my diet so I could become top idol. Do you have any idea what I've been through? No, but now I'm hungry and it's all your fault. I'm gonna go get some takoyaki. You wait right there. <laughs> Rude, is she skinny shaming? Yeah, she is. <laughs> that was good. I had three helpings because of you. Thanks for that. Helpings, but I thought you were trying to diet. Shut up! Who asked you? What I really wanted to have was cake, but I stopped myself. But what would you know? You could never understand. Oh no. What time is it? The t-shirt sale at the supermarket is about to end. They're on sale for only 500 yen each. If I miss that sale, it'll be all your fault. Uh, wait a minute. When you said you were working on your hard rope, did you mean bargain t-shirts? There's a supermarket sale, you have to go in prepared for battle. They're serious business. <laughs> Maybe true, but a bargain t-shirt isn't really what most people call would call fashionable, don't you think? You've got something to say about everything, don't you? Little stick girl. 
I'll get my revenge on you. Just you wait. You better enjoy your life while you still can. <laughs> uh, well, Lala, sure something. Jesus. Uh, I need to come back here in a bit. And she'll be back there and I, we can continue. <coughs> Akihiko, are you really, really serious? You're really gonna quit comedy? Haro, I'm telling you, my mind's made up and you can't sway me. The comedian hopeful, I guess. But how can you give up on our dream like that? We've been a duo for four years now. You're just gonna throw that all away? It's not like I want to throw it all away, but think about it. Do you really think we got a shot making it all the way? Yeah, I do. I believe in us. We're gonna make it real big someday. That's why we've been working so hard for these past four years, isn't it? Well, great for you. I don't believe anymore. You hadn't had a glimmer of hope in four years. We did hundreds of auditions, but we didn't get back, called back for a single one. Okay, yeah, that might be true, but if you work on being a better straight man, and I can work on being a better funny yeah. man. But that's what we've been doing for four years, and it hasn't happened yet. We ain't getting any younger, you know. But do you have to quit right now? You have an audition in a couple of minutes. Why can't you wait to see how that goes first? I've got some really great material this time. All you gotta do is come back with some great retorts. My mom found me a lead on a good job. Sorry, man. But I'm on my way to an interview right now. If I'm gonna quit comedy, now's the time to do it. I don't want my mom worrying about me anymore, you know? Goodbye. How do you? How do you? Sayonara! Man, what am I supposed to do without a partner? Um, excuse me, is something wrong? See, I'm part of a comedy duel, but my partner just quit on me. We have an audition that's about to start and everything. Man, I don't know what to do. Hey, wait a minute, I know you. You're that idol, Haruka Saramuda. Um, well, yes I am. Well, I can't believe I'm seeing the, the real you in person. I've been a fan of yours ever since I saw you on TV. Thank you very much. You're funny too. You did a great job with the back and forth when you were on that talk show. And some real knee slappers. You really think so? I was just trying to talk about what I thought the viewers would like to hear. And it just happened to go well. That ain't easy. You got something real special. Hold on, hold on. I'm getting an idea here. What is it? That's it. Haruka, have you ever thought about doing comedy? Comedy? Me? You see, anyone else here, I'm telling you. You'd be good. This audition's coming up means the world to me. I lost a lot of sleep coming up with this material, and I've got some real good stuff, don't you know? I couldn't stand it if I had to forfeit the audition because my partner quit. I need a favor. Could you be my partner? Please, pretty please? You only need to do with this once. What? But I don't have any experience. Don't worry about that. You've already been on TV loads of times. That ought to help you out. It'll be fine. Besides, it'll be good for your career to polish your comedy skills. It'll, it could really come in handy for your work. Just think of all the successful idols. <clears throat> they're not only attractive and good at singing, but they're all extra charming, right? Hmm. Guess you're right. But it can be funny. I don't know any good jokes ever or anything. Don't worry about a thing. I already thought up all the material. All you have to do is have some good comebacks ready when I say something silly or stupid. I think you'd be great at it. I bet you could hit me with all kinds of great retorts. So what do you say, Arika? Will you be the straight man to my fool? The sun to my shine? The taco to my yaki? Hmm. Might be a good idea to learn something about comedy. Should I do it? Give it a try. Well, yeah, all right. Thank you. I have a feeling this is going to be great. In that case, we better come up with a name. A name?
game. Haru, Haru. <laughs> Haru and Haru. Starts with Haru, mine starts with Haru. It's a dang perfect name for a perfect team. Great. Now that we got all an all-star name. I can't English. I'm sure we're gonna be a big hit. Well, I hate to rush it, but are you ready to go? The audition is about to start. Yeah. A good comedian's gotta go with the flow. Learn to handle whatever comes her way. It's important to know how to wing it. You have to be able to take sudden pressure like this in stride. See, what's a little audition? No big deal, right? You can do it. Now, how about we get to the event hall? Right, I can do this. Only comedy audition here. Today's the first round. Those who pass all three rounds get a spot on the comedy show. Only helping out for today, aren't I? What will you do for the second round no more? <laughs> well, worry about that when I come to it. I'm sure everything will work out. <laughs> okay then. Turn is coming up soon, isn't it? I'm feeling a little nervous. Just be yourself. You're gonna be fine, Haruki-chan. How about we rehearse a little? I'll bring up a topic and you interject with something that fits. You know, keep the conversation flowing by saying stuff like, is that so? Interjections, blah blah blah. Sounds tricky. No need to overthink it. It's just like a normal conversation, you see. And when I say something silly, you hammer it home with some kind of clever retort. Like, what the hell are you thinking? I see. Got natural talent, so I know you'll come up with the withiest comebacks. Just pick the one you think works the best, and you'll be splitting sides like a comedy lumberjack. I'll give it a shot. <coughs> Free to go back and go for the second and third rounds to complete the comedy team in the game. Wait. Oh, crap baskets. Got it. Laughter gauge. Uh, next one is circle. Triangle. Triangle. ちょい悪いってやつですわ。なるほど。ねえ、高校の頃とかみんなそういうのに憧れるやないですか。せやから僕も結構モテてたんですわ。ほうほう。え、サークル。ネクストスクエア。ね、学校の校門とかで、あ
E, so it was guy? <laughs> uh, triangle, triangle. Laughs. Hundred percent first class entertainer. Amazing, we did it. My heart was racing. I'm glad it went well. I knew you were the real deal. Your timing's great, Haruka-chan. Thank you. Now we passed the first round. Time to head back to the rest for the rest. Okay. Hey, thanks a lot, Haruka. You really saved my bacon. I'm so glad I could help, but that was just one round of the addition, right? Aren't there more after this? Yeah, that's the truth, but I don't want to bother you in none. I'll just find a new partner to do the rest of the edition with, I guess, you see. Well, I hope you find someone. It would be a shame to fail after coming this far. Arakachan, I know I'm usually the fool, but I gotta be straight with you for once. I wish you and I could keep on going together a little longer. I mean, yeah, we were pretty good together up there, don't you think? I bet we could get pretty far, you and me. Think you could stick around a little longer? Hmm, I don't know. Well, it's no skin off my back, if you can't, I understand. But if you ever get the urge to do some more comedy, I'm always down to split sides and slap knees. I hang around this area a lot, so you ought to be able to find me if you go looking. Don't let all the glitz and star starlight up on that idle stage blind you. You always got a place here. Alright, Haruo. Thank you, I won't forget. I'll be back if I ever change my mind. By the way, this is the price for passing the first round. Edition. I think it's good for you to have it. Yeah, we're gonna do this ASAP right now. Because it's a minigame we need to clear anyways. Um, in the completion list and minigames. The comedy team evaluation rounds passed. Uh, where the fuck did he go? Hmm? Uh, miss, excuse me. Excusey. Hmm. Nanyakore. Revelations we need to do as well. Manager of the day. Nice. Mm -hmm. Aren't you Haruka-chan, that big idol from TV? I'd recognize that face anywhere. Mm. That's right, I'm Haruka Sawamura. Thank you so much for watching. Well, would you look at that, a famous star like you just strolling down the street? Why not try some of my takoyaki before you go? <laughs> but don't worry, it's on the house. As you can see, it's not exactly busy here. In a bit of slump, you might say. Just can't understand. It's because my takoyaki is really good. Give to care. Give to take it to pa pa try? Sure. <laughs> There's a good girl. Here you go. Real magutako takoyaki. Nothing more Osaka than this. Thank you very much. Phew, it's hot. So what do you think? Good, right? Hmm. It really is. It's delicious. See? I tell you, best in the city. If I do say so myself. I just can't figure out why people ain't lining up to come and get it. Maybe I gotta advertise some more spurs up my stand or something. I tell you, I'm stumped. If only people would try a bite, they'd be hooked, I'm sure. You think so? Well, it's awfully kind of you to say. Thank you, Haruka-chan. Hey, if you ever get the chance, maybe you can talk about this place on TV. <laughs> I don't know. I don't get many chests to say whatever I want yeah. on TV. <laughs> oh, I'm just pulling your leg. You're an idol, after all. It's not like you're a comedian or anything. I'm sorry. Hey, I know. Wanna be my manager for the day? If you do that for me... I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. What did you have me do? Hmm, no, just stand in front of my shop, maybe? That'll do the trick. That really draw customers, do you think? Wouldn't it? I know I'd get me to stop by. Well then, how about a handshake event? I can shake hands with whomever buys your takoyaki. Hmm, really do that for me? Of course. Oh, but wait, I better check with my agency to make sure if that's alright. I don't think they'll have any objections, though. That'd be fantastic. 
Subarashi! Why do I keep saying Subarashi today? They said yes. They thought it would be a great idea to help out a local business. They did? Wonderful! I'll start setting, getting ready right away. And I'll change into my work outfit. Right, folks, today we have a special guest here at Magutaku, singer Haruka Sawamura-chan. She agreed to be my manager of the day. Try out special bargain, a simple three-pack of takoyaki, only 100 yen. Each lucky person who buys takoyaki today will receive a warm handshake from our special manager of the day, Haruka! Step on up and try this takoyaki, everyone. It's absolutely delicious. I'll take it back! Hey, you're Haruka-chan from the Princess League. I want to shake your hand. Mommy, can I shake Haruka-chan's hand too? I'll take some takoyaki. Say Haruka-chan. How about some nice warm handshakes for our wonderful new customers? Of course. No, we don't need to. We figured it out last time. <laughs> need to hold it out a little bit longer. <laughs> Wait until the man behind starts blinking color. Arigatou gozaimasu. Okay, time for the crazy people. <laughs> Okay, that's more than enough to get max. Oh, wait, I thought I pressed. Oh, it didn't press. Oh, that sucks. Ah, oh, I pressed too soon or something. Something went wrong there. Ah, oh, good enough though. Thank you so much for doing that, Haruka. Oh no, I was glad to. <laughs> Never seen so many customers lining up. You sure can draw a crowd. And they all seemed over the moon to shake your hands. I'd wager I'm gonna have a whole slew of new regulars thanks to you. This is a great success, if you ask me. I better roll up my sleeves tomorrow, because it looks like I'm gonna be busy. Thank you, Haruka. I'm just happy I could help. Here's your reward for being my manager of today. I threw in a little extra too. Are you sure? Thank you very much. It's me who should be thanking you. You really gave Magutako a boost today. I hope he'll be back. Hell yeah. I'll be back once I have an empty belly. AKA, um... Energy to waste. Okay, there's the guy. Let me first go take a picture of uh, the... Skinny slandering, uh... Person. <gasps> Lol. The pose. Okay, everyone. This top idol is gonna show you how dancing is done. They're actually joining in, what the frick? And now they're all like, never mind.
There's no way. Was backflip, yo. You learned Rainbow Prism Star. Crazy. Okay, continue minigame. Uh, this one can go away because we did that. Thanks for coming, Harika chan. Let's get back to the auditioning for the show. Give it a try. Just do it like before. We'll get cruise. We'll cruise through and look like we're up next. Let's go. あ、<笑><笑> That's a bad guy, not a hero. That's <laughs> totally a bad guy. How'd you figure? So you are a bad guy. God damn it. So much for being a hero. This guy just keeps getting slapped though. Um uh, after square share you are, we got circle, got that right. Actually, I have one key weakness. Uh, circle, got that right. I'd be weak to girls. Girls? Oh, fucking damn it. I'll start the bad guys. Hundred two lifts. Everyone was laughing so hard, it made me really happy and I had a ton of fun. It's the power of laughter. It's all about making magic with the crowd. Once you get the crowd warmed up, hearing them chortling away encourages you. So we can get them even more worked up. That interplay is key. I guess you could say the same about performing songs. It's important to acknowledge the crowd. Ain't that the truth? Now we're through to the last round. Guess we should head home and get some rest for now. Heading home? Getting rest? Nani sore. One more round, let's go! Taking up a new ball, a buddy. Buddy! Oh ho. 
<laughs> I want to hear your engine roar. <laughs> Got that. No already. I'm going to go full throttle on you. I said that's enough. But motorcycles are great, huh? You can really get up close and personal with your girl. Square. This is the so small triangle. Uh, yeah, that's true. Triangle. Uh, triangle square. TMI. She's driving. <laughs> what the heck? Triangle. You know, with a sidecar. <laughs> Square. Mm. Uh, circle sounds like fun, square. Some real teamwork. Just like her teamwork in the sack. God damn it. Yaminasai. You can honk my horn. What does that even mean? Totally let her pop my clutch. What are you talking about? Circle. Circle. Just driving a car too? Uh, yeah, I don't have car license either. <laughs> Damn it. Easy, that's another thing clear. I think this is the dumbest shit yet, but it's funny. It wasn't that hard. I bet it, on the original it was harder because you couldn't pause during. And some of those were incredibly fast. Thank God we can pause in this one. Don't believe it, we actually passed. Holy takoyaki, I think I'm in shock. I can't even think straight. Kind of stunned too. This is the first for me. I had no idea we could make it this far. Gotta say, your perfect timing was probably a big part of it. Never got laughs this big with my old partner. Don't be silly. It's all thanks to your stellar jokes. You think? Telling me things like that only is gonna inflate my ego. <laughs> That's eating a Chihara-chan. Mm. It's just I'm gonna miss this now that it's all over. I hear ya. Well, every ending is new beginning, as they say. Let's head out. Okay. Okie dokie. I've been thinking, Haruka-chan, what would you say uh, to carry on as my partner? Got real chemistry as a team, passing this edition, bound to get his gigs on TV shows too. But... Aro, there you are. Akiko, what's up? Thought you found yourself a job, yeah, but I changed my mind. I went to the job interview, but I pulled out to the last minute. They asked me what my goal was. I had a good heart thinking about that one. What is it I really want out of life? After about three minutes of the old gears turning, I told them all I want to do is conquer the comedy world. Then I up and left. Sorry for what I did to you, Aro. I really, I realized I really do want comedy with you. Will you team up with me again? Say what? Come on, we can crush together. Congratulations on getting the team back together. 
Haruka-chan? This is Cutie. My name is Haruka-chan. Nice to meet you. I'm one of Haro's fans. For real? That's awesome. I'll be rooting for you, Haro. I know one day you're going to rock the comedy world. Yeah. Yeah! As comedians and pop idols live in two different worlds, we gotta walk our own path. Talking about idols? Nah, never mind. Wait, whatever. We're a team again! Let's make this happen. This is goodbye, Haruka-chan. Maybe we'll run into each other on a TV show someday. This is your share of the edition prize. Take it, Haruka. Thank you. This was a great experience for me. Comedy is pretty interesting. I'll have to give it another shot sometime. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Oh yeah, if you ever feel like doing some comedy again, just let me know. You usually found me around these parts. No more additions for us, but that don't mean we can't practice our comedy routine together. Let's set course to the stars. We can talk over some joke ideas in the park over there. Yeah, let's ready up for the next edition. Dun 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 dun. Lizzie has arrived. What do you mean this time too? Okay, let's see how many quests have we done so far. There are two over there, one over there, one down here. Dun 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 dun! Me back. Welcome back, Lizzie. You missed this fantastic comedy show. Of course, of course. Yeah, my manager told me I won't last much longer. Yeah, mom, I know. If that happens, I promise I'll come home. We both knew the entertainment business wouldn't be easy. Yeah, okay, I'll talk to you later, all right? Yep, bye. Lol, your D isn't funny. That's true, I am not funny. Oh, you're Harka-chan, aren't you? Mm-hmm, yes, that's right. Do you remember me by chance? Right, of course you don't. Why would you? Sorry, where did we meet? The Princess League. Kind of an idol too, actually. But you knocked me out in one of the earlier rounds, so... But hey, don't get me wrong. It's not like I'm holding a grudge against you or anything. I want you to know that. My name is Asuka Sugino. I'm with the agency Blue Skies. Well, for now anyway. They might not renew my contract. Is that because you didn't win Prince League? I wish I could say it's n not because of that, but yes, I think that was a big part of it. My manager even hinted as much. See, you've been on TV a lot since then, haven't you? I always watch you on the I always watch you on the Prince League. I hate to admit it, but the people who are left on the show sure are a lot better than me. My self-taught style just can't compete, I guess. Don't you have an instructor to give you lessons? I do, but he spends all of his time with the cuter, more talented girls at the agency. And even since I lost, and ever since I lost the Prince League, my manager's been concentrating the other girls even more, and I haven't had any gigs. That's awful. I guess I can understand it though. I just don't have the problems those girls do. My manager even told me he might be ending my contracts depending on how I do on the next event. Oh gee, I'm sorry. Here I get this nice chance to talk to you and I spent this whole time complaining. Oh no, no need to apologize, I completely understand how you feel. Our contract might be ending soon, and I can't help but feel responsible. I wonder if there's anything I, I can do. Kachan, where is your next event? It hasn't started yet, and it isn't really my event. It's not like anybody would come to see just me. I'll just be opening for one of the other girls at my agency. My manager said that's the best he can do for me. Until then. If you'd like, maybe I can help somehow. Help me, for example. Is there anything you feel unsure of when you're on stage? Maybe I could share some of the things my instructors have taught me. Uh, south side, midpoint. Okay. You do that for me? Oh, thank you. Yes, I actually have a really hard time with dancing. And it's not like I just feel unsure. I'm generally terrible. I've hardly had any lessons either. If you need lessons, why not give a dance battle a try? Dance battles? That's right. I've learned a lot from doing dance battles myself. People have dance battles on the street all the time. Like, we get to be each other's instructor and help one another grow. And some of the dancers are self-taught, just like you. I learn something new every time. Idols don't complain, lady. 
they do just not uh, in front of their fans you know you and I could have one together right now if you think it might help you in any way sounds like fun okay then Haruka-chan let's have a dance battle dance battle Yoroshiku onegai shimasu Damn it, Haruka is too strong. Well, you really are good, Haruka. I could never compete. But look at how good you are. You're completely self-taught. Yeah, well, I can still tell I'm nowhere near any kind of match for you. I don't know about that. I'm Haruka-chan. Uh, you've been so nice to me. Do you think I could have your cell phone number? I'd love to call you sometime, if you don't mind, that is. Okay, let's get Chan. That would be great. Great, I'll call you then. Be looking forward to it still, been thinking. Done so many of these dance battles and they've helped you get to where you are today, right? Compared to you, what have I been doing with my time? I get kind of down thinking about it. Let's get Chan. I have a little brother, by the way. Hmm? He's the reason I want to be an idol. Unlike me, he's really, really smart. And I'm not just saying that because I'm his sister. Anyway, we don't have a lot of money, so I'd love to help send him to good private school. I thought maybe if I could do well as an idol, I could use the money for his education. But things aren't really working out like I planned. But now, you've given me some pointers on dancing. I'm finally starting to get my hopes up again. If I work really hard up until the next event, maybe I'll be able to keep going. That's the spirit. Good for you. <laughs> but is there anything else you want to work on in particular? I guess it would be my stage presence. You know, my movement and facial expression on stage feel really awkward up there. His presence, huh? Maybe you could give me an example. Show me how it's done. That would be awesome. Really? Thank you, Haruka-chan. I'll be right here waiting, so whenever you're ready, just let me know. Show your talent. I don't know how much of an example I can be. I'm actually kind of nervous, but I'll certainly do my best. Thank you so much, Haruka-chan. Haruka-chan! So this is your agency. Do you have lessons here all the time? That's right. Welcome to Dyna Chair, Haruka-chan. Thank you for the warm welcome. All right, are you ready? I'm going to play some music and show you how I do a live performance. It isn't much, but if you think it'll be of any help at all, I'll be sure to do my very best. I really appreciate this, Haruka-chan, and yes, I think it'll be a help, big help.
You're already dancing again. Oh. I almost missed the last part again. Fuck my life. Lizzie, why? Why am I such a pleb? That wasn't bad, if I do say so myself. Whoa, haruka that was amazing. I couldn't have looked away if I wanted to. But you were pretty great during the Princess League primarily preliminaries. But you've gotten even better since then. Oh, thank you. I really learned a lot watching you. And you helped me see what I need to work on. I have to work as hard as I can if I want to do well at the next event. Good luck, Skechan. I'll be rooting for you. Thank you, haruka You know, this is the nicest anyone has been to me since I came to Osaka. I'll do everything I can to stay in this business. Thank you for all your help, Haruka-chan. Uh, there's a dance battler here, right? Mm, completion list. We need to do all the heat actions as well. Barehanded, terrain, climax. Wait, do... Uh... Haruka's moves not go in the heat actions. That is actually kind of good to know. So let me change up some art, jazz, high, dance heat, normal. Let's try this one. <clears throat> okay, um, Groove Booster, Charming Cuteness, Heart Strike. Heart Strike is new, Rainbow Prism, mm, the rest I've done. Hmm? Dancer Rank B. Yeah, okay, let's do dance battle. Dance, dance. This is not jazz. This doesn't sound like jazz at all. Sounds more like a magical girl dance. Hard. Bro, that was hard! Huh? Jesus! Huh? I'm impressed, I didn't know you were that good. Oh, shut up! Do you know how hard I need to improvise? I wasn't even paying attention to that. I was just trying to find the buttons. 
Hi, it's me, Asuka. Thanks again for the lessons. Oh, I didn't do much, but you're certainly welcome. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You really helped me out a lot. Thanks to you, Haruka-chan. I'm enjoying singing and dancing more than ever. I feel like a brand new me. Really? I'm so glad. But um, could I ask you a favor? Sorry if this is sudden, but do you think we could meet? Sure, is everything okay? I'll just tell you when I see you. I'll be waiting for you where we first met on the Shofuchiku side river. Really appreciate this, Haruka-chan. Sorry again to just ask you out of the blue. See you soon. That was uh, intense, I'm not gonna lie. Arkachan. Hmm? Oh, Askachan. Oh, your outfit. Does that mean you're about to have your event? That's right. That's why I need to see you, actually. If it don't do well, I'll have to pack it all in and go back home. Askachan, you're nervous, aren't you? Really nervous. Ever since I found out about the event, it's been... Uh, it's like I've been frozen. I'm so scared I'm going to mess everything up. You think you could come to the event with me? I don't think I can do this alone. Of course, I'll go with you. Thank you, Arkachan. You're the best. Yay, she's going home. This is silly, right? I mean, it's not even like anyone's here to see me. I'm just opening for somebody else. Like, I'm still, I'm so nervous. Of course it's okay. And after you just went to all the trouble to show me how it's done, I bet you feel like you wasted your time with me, huh? Poor Asuka. What can I say to help her feel less nervous? Uh, tell her it's natural to feel nervous. It's only natural to feel nervous. I bet there isn't a person alive who doesn't feel nervous before stepping on the stage. Really? Even you, haruka Of course, I get nervous every single time I have to appear in front of people. <laughs> <laughs> well, even you? Well, that helps me feel less alone. Thank you, haruka I think I feel even a little bit braver now. Asuka, what are you doing? You're on any second. You can't just stand around chatting with your friends. I'm sorry. This might be your last event. Make sure you give it everything you've got out there. No regrets here. Are you okay, Asuka-chan? Well, I wouldn't exactly say I'm okay, but I have to do what I have to do, right? asuka ever since I met you, I've been working as hard as I can. I've been getting into dancing more, and it's helped me feel a little more, more confident. But now that I have some more hope again, it makes me scared to think it could all end with this event. I just know I could be better. I could be a better singer, better dancer. What do I do, Haruka-chan? I'm so nervous. I'm scared to get on stage. Think positive! Asuka, you have to think positive. If you give up before you even start, you're, you've even started, you'll just be psyching yourself out. You can do this. And just think, most idol, most idol hopefuls never even get the chance to stand on the stage. Instead of thinking of this as or a do or die crisis, think of it as a lucky opportunity. Your one big chance. Exactly. You know what? You're right. I've been feeling so much pressure lately, but if I turned it around and think of it that way, I do feel a lot better. Thank you, Haruka-chan. I'll give it a try. This is my big chance, after all. Good luck, Hasuka, uh, Hasuka Asuka-chan. Lizzie is sleepy. I feel you, Lizzie. Same. Hello, everybody. I'm Asuka Sugino. It's ready for a good time. No, you can do this, Asuka-chan. Come, buddy! Hey, Haruka-chan. Asuka-chan. Thank you so much again for coming with me to my event. You spent all the time with me, even though we're so busy. It really meant a lot. I was happy to come. My manager just talked to me about my contract, did he? And he said, after seeing me at today's event, he's going to renew it. Really? Oh, that's wonderful news, Asuka-chan. I'm going to give the Princess League another try next year. My agency instructor said he would give me lots of lessons to get ready. My parents are so happy for me. And it's all thanks to you, Haruka-chan. Almost six more months. No, it's all thanks to your hard work. You stepped up and seized your opportunity when you saw it. But I never could have done it if you hadn't helped me. That's, that's why I wanted to give you this to say thanks. It isn't much, though. Oh, thank you, Asuka-chan. 
I'm going to study hard and take lots of lessons. Who knows, maybe you and I will even be a rival someday. And I guess I better study hard too. <laughs> I can't thank you enough for all you, of your help, Haruka-chan. Haruka-chan! Why did Haruka look so shocked? Don't ask me. I'm not Haruka-chan. In fact, I'm way too old to be Haruka-chan. What level am I, 16? But you are. You are controlling her. But I can't control her... Um, everything else. No thanks. Okay, what were the... Um, foods again? We need to go to Kushikatsu Daruma, Tsuruhashi Fugetsu, and Magutako. This is Magutako, right? Yeah. La da 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 na 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 <laughs> Gotta start cleaning up and leaving. Bye, Lizzie. Sayonara. Huh? Talk to you later. Alligators. Uh, Tsuhari, Fugetsi, Kani, Doru, Ma, Gonko, Sushi, Subaru, Ya, Style Bar, Kishikatsu, Duruma. Go mine. So which ones did I need again? And Tsuruhashi Fugetsu. Which is there. Where is uh, Mr. Stinky Face? Oh, over there. No, let's go do everything else first. Pardon me, miss. May I ask you a question? Me? Me? Would you by chance consider yourself a gamer? A gamer? You know, a gamer, a person who likes to play video games? Yes. I knew it. In that case, could you spare a moment? Uh, could you spare a moment of your time right this way? What want me to do? <laughs> Apologies, I should have been more clear. It's nothing weird, I can assure you. If you could just spare a minute, I'll be... You'll be back in no time. Doctor, I've brought a girl gamer. I'm sorry it took so long. Ah, long last. Now we can finally begin the experiment. Um, experiment? What kind of experiment? <laughs> I'm Dr. Minamida, and this device is the new version of my fighting simulator, Inner Fighter 8 Road Battle. It's called IF8 for short. It's a revolutionary gaming device of my own invention. It utilizes so special electromagnetic waves to allow the player to play inside their own head. We'd like you to test it out. I'm afraid I still don't really understand. <laughs> I'm not surprised, my dear. I have eight is still in development, you see. Um, though I am indeed its creator, there are still lots about it I don't quite understand myself. Mina Mida. I know there is a special one with Haruka, but I can't really tell if there's anything I can do with that. Also, no device variant of the game for young ladies. Jump and duck like anyone else, but her main light attack is swing her wand and heavy attack, a project goal attack that can be charged. Uh, okay, we need to test it. This particular IF-8 is a female version. I've modified it to specifically suit to female gamers like you. My assistant here has, was so proud of this modification that I rushed to Osaka to see it, but apparently it's only suited for female players. And here you are at last, so I would be the very first one to use it. Precisely! But there's absolutely nothing to be afraid of, my dear. I'm sure you will enjoy it immensely. 
In this game, you'll become a magical heroine and combat fearsome enemies within your mind. Haven't you always dreamed of doing something like that? I suppose when I was younger. Well, this game makes that dream a reality, but instead of trying to explain it, perhaps I should just let you try it for yourself. Are you ready? Before she tests it, she'll need to sign an agreement. We talked about agreement. You must maintain absolute secrecy about the IF8 project while it's being developed. We therefore need you to sign a no-disclosure agreement, non-disclosure agreement. Well, I don't know about signing something that's so suddenly like that. Cooperation would be most appreciated. It isn't as easy as you... Uh, it isn't as easy to acquire a female gamer tester as one might think. This was 2012, guys. Ten years later, girls be jumping all over the place. Should you please consider helping us? The chance to become a magical heroine of your dreams is just a sign away. All right. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Wonderful, my dear. My assistant here will prepare the document for you. Meanwhile, I'll be getting the device ready. Now, before you begin, allow me to explain the particulars. IF-8 has players move along the city streets and vanish enemies using their magical powers. A powerful boss awaits at the end. Defeat this boss and you'll receive a boost of to your abilities. Not those of player character, but your own. You mean my own personal abilities will increase if I win the game? Precisely, but I'm afraid we're still in the process of gathering data, so only one city is available for play at the moment. You'll be able to play other cities once we've collected enough data, but unfortunately you'll have to wait long for that. Ordinarily, one play would cost 10,000 yen, but for this first time only we'll let you test it free of charge. Well, that's just about covers it. You can try it right away, or if you prefer, you can have me explain again. Play the game. Ah. Very well, then, without further delay, let's begin. <laughs> There's not much of a magical girl transformation here now, is there? Still alive. Battle Mai. Mai who? Oh, she can block. Can I block as well? Smack that all on the floor. Nice. Smack them booty cheeks. It looks like you cleared it. Congratulations. You should now experience a boost to your own abilities. <laughs> You've given us a great, some great data. Maximum heat gauge increased. You're welcome to come back anytime. Uh, we'll be waiting here for you. Thank you for your help. We hope to see you again. 
Harka, you know, you should never go into, uh... Wait, where the fuck am I all the way down here all of a sudden? Oh, well, at least we can deliver, um, one of the food thingies. Which should allow us to eat above our health, right? There you are. Find some great places. Recommend an eatery. Magu taco. Yeah, so look at that. Kore ski da na. Oh, I like this. That was delicious. And it should really help me come up with ideas for a new dish. i give you some advice to thank you for telling me about such a great place. Material. For May in training. And now we should be able to... do Kyushita Durama. Do that one first before we head into a new... Quiz though, or side quest, sorry. This is not very. Actually, pretty chill for me now that I think about it. That means we can run to the other side as well for the other food. Which was Tsuruhashi Fugetsu. The first side quest. Hey, you're Haruka-chan, aren't you? Hmm? It is you. I knew it. I'm a big fan of yours. I always watch you on TV. I can't believe I'm seeing you out and about like this. Chan from the Princess League? Oh, no. Are? That can... Oh, autograph session. Oh, that's not too bad. Three, three, first, second. Don't be kidding me. Chan is here. They're saying Haruka Chan is over here! Get your eyes checked out in any time recently. She's right there. Hello. Oh man, I'm sorry, Haruka Chan. Me and my big mouth look at all these people. Oh, it's alright. Really? You mean it? In that case, could I have your autograph? Hey, I want an autograph too. Me too. Can I have an autograph? Talking about, you're the bulb who came up with the bright idea. Hi. Of course, I'd be happy to give everyone my autograph. Great, okay, people, listen up. Please form an orderly line. We don't want to block traffic here. Dad made you king. Hi. All right, thank you. Yasuhiro Yamasaki. Second. Misaki Takahashi. Misaki Takahashi. Yeah, that's exactly it. Thank you, Haruka. I'll be rooting for you, girl. Thank you very much. I believe I'm going to get your autograph. I'm a huge fan. Toshikazu Sekiguchi. 
Kikuchi. That's right, this is beautiful. I'll treasure it forever! My turn, my whole family always watches you on TV, you know? Thank you very much. Who am I making this out to? Oh, right. Could you make it out to Hideaki Ishikawa? That's weird wobbling, yo. My favorite of his is that one where he lays the smack down on all those street thugs. Man, I wish I was as cool as him. I don't think I've seen that movie. Well, thanks for the autograph, Haruka-chan. It's my turn, I saw you on TV. You did? Thank you for watching. What's your name? It's Akiharu Fukushima. <laughs> you really know how to spell that? Yep, it's my own name, isn't it? All right, I guess that makes sense. Let's see, Akiharu Fukushima. Yeah, that's perfect, woohoo. Was well, it hard to spell your name when you were first learning to write? Nah, it was easy. Kind of dummy would I be if I couldn't write my own name? <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. All right, people, you all got your autographs this session. It's now officially over. Like you said, who made you king? Thank you very much for your time, Haruka chan Thank you all very much. I hope you all continue to support me. Of course we will. Good luck, Haruka chan You're the best. Be watching you on TV. We all wanted to thank you, so we pitched in and got you this. We're sorry for swarming you earlier. Stamina Spark. Better split before anybody else shows up. But let's give Haruka-chan a big round of applause. You want the whole town to come running over? Might as well get on the bullhorn. Oh, right, sorry. <laughs> When people get too excited, yada yada does he? There should be another quest near the arcade. Doc. Yama Uda. You got a sack? Yama Uda. Yes, of course. Do the names Watami and Watamin Chi ring a bell? Hmm. They're restaurants, right? I'm actually standing in front of Watami right now. You are perfect. Why is that? Hang on, let me back up a bit. To me, it's a Japanese casual restaurant, and Wataminchin is a charcoal grill restaurant. They're both part of the Watamin group, and both are looking for a new poster girl right now. You want me to apply? Do you think I'm just sitting on my hands over here? I sent in your application a while ago. Matter of fact, I just got the response from them saying you passed the first stage. You did? Next stage is an audition process, is an interview, so I'll need you to... To fill you in on that. Can you come by the agency when you get a minute? Of course. Thank you, Yamadura san. By the way, you might want to check Watamin out before the interview. I mean, you're right there, so it works out perfectly. Yeah, I guess you're right. You're right. It might feel kind of weird going in alone. All right, never mind. Be waiting at the agency office. See you soon, kid. Watamin chi. Okay. Well, I don't really give a shit. Got something else to do. Which equals uh, strengthening my power. This is the place, right? Yeah. Tsuhuru Hashi Fugetsu. Let me show you your table. May I take your order, please? Okay, get this one done. Okay, that is ready. 
I'll do that side mission at the agency later. Like, tomorrow most likely. And I'm gonna go... Finish off the gourmet shizu first. Shouldn't be too bad. Too many people. Get the fuck out of my way, bro. Yeah. I'll be right behind you. Itadakimasu! Dialogue doesn't really change anyway, so we can skip through all of this. Master Gumont. Good me. Yeah! Oh man, that makes me so fucking hungry. I've been hungry this entire time. I just want to eat something nice and I don't have anything. Hey. Gonna do dish in a bit after our uh, stream. Because my house is a mess. dish. Now he should be northeast of... East southwest. I literally ran the person over. Jesus. Okay, I'm kind of taking that as there is nobody here. Right now. I guess I need to wait until a little bit later. Until we made a little bit more progress in the story. That's fine, that just means we're gonna go save! We made some decent progress today, I'd say. No crashes, no needing to start over. Ugh. All works very well for Yordi's mental health. <laughs> uh. Just thinking about it makes me... Uh, Squeamish. <laughs> Thankfully, the mini game, the most of the mini games that we needed to do were really not that bad, which was really good. Uh, yeah, ladies and gents, gents and gentle ladies, thank you all very much for hanging out with me tonight. Hope you all had a fantastic time. No screaming, no cursing. That saves me mental health issues. <laughs> uh, the plan is to be back tomorrow and uh, continue. That is the plan. Uh, unless something goes miserably wrong, I get sick, tired, whatever. I should be online tomorrow. If not, well, then uh, I'll be uh, back Monday. Yeah, I'm gonna try my best to keep, like, continue, uh, continue the schedule again. Uh, other than that, I don't really have anything else to say. Thank you all very much for watching tonight. I hope you all had a fantastic evening. Sweet dreams for later, sleep well, and until the next time, adios and good night.